Hello, everybody, and welcome to, personally, my most hyped run that I get to see this entire event, other than my own. It is Pokemon Coliseum Any Percent. It's a race between Evan Evan Evanesia, the only one, Zeke, and Ryzekin. And with commentary from Randall East Cheese, who did blindfolded Brock earlier today. Hello, everybody. I'm Randall, and I'm going to be overseeing this salsa race as all of us are going to be starting a new game quite soon. I'm just going to make sure that Zeke is able to get to the intro page before I accidentally start them yeah, all at the wrong I'll time. Just, play, yeah, no, don't it's worry. Fine. It's fine. Yeah, don't worry. Just make sure that uh, everyone's doing well, and yeah, I hope y'all have a good night, day, wherever you might be, and hope y'all enjoy the salsa along the way. Uh, so, just while we're getting ready, I'm gonna be making sure that, like, just to keep y'all informed, uh, Ava's gonna be going for Manip, and Juan and Ryzkin and Zeke have their save file set up in a way that uh, it's just not going to be worth it to minute. So, yeah. The only person who's going to be hitting minute I, I be Ava. I do also have a save file, of course, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because a uh, very important feature is that to run this game, you need very good stats. Uh, if anyone wants to elaborate on that. We can probably just go ahead and get started, uh, and then explain on the way, right? Yeah, that works too. Plenty of you want to do a countdown? Everyone ready? So, we'll start on five. Five, four, three, two, one, begin! Alright, should we introduce ourselves? Go for it. Uh, let's start with Ava. Going... Alright, uh, I'm Ava Nietzsche. Uh, I speedrun these games, uh, both Pokemon Coliseum and Pokemon XT. Uh, I've been doing it for quite a while now. Uh, obviously everyone here is more experienced than me, but still, uh, I've been going on for quite a while. I also speedrun uh, platformers like I had in Fam and Celeste, so yeah, um, uh, that's pretty much it for me. So if you want to throw it back to someone else, feel free to. Yeah, I'm gonna just go in order, so Juan, you're next. No, I'm Juan. Uh, I've ran every starter except Croc. I, I despise Croc. I didn't start running this game until Croc was out of the meta. Um, but ready. yeah, go Bailey. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Alright, so now we're going to have Croc state, uh, Zeke state Croc's case, I guess. Oh, yeah, no. uh, hi, I'm Zeke. I, I'm a Monopoly speedrunner, and I apparently play this game also. It's, uh, the, the blue fish is really good. It has a move that hits two Pokemon in one turn. It's really awesome. Fish. Uh, yeah, he's, he's, he swims, he's a fish. Okay, I cross a fish. Alligators are not fish. It's not an alligator, dude. dude. Alright, Ryzekin, you're up. Uh, hello, I'm Ryzekin. I have speedrun this game off and on for a pretty long time. Since before we had any other routes besides Croc. Dabbled a little bit in uh, Bayleaf as well, but definitely spent most of my time with Quilava once we finally had it. Be fun game. Uh, I've done all snags. Um, done no snags. Pretty much every category except 100%. Alright, so some really great runners, great routers of this game, and some others as well, so best be putting in your respect for all of them, and also laugh every time someone makes fun of any of the starters, because we're going to do a lot of that. Heck yeah. Oh yeah, by the way, I didn't hit the nap. I was one primarily. Ah, <laughs> uh, all right. All we're right. on the same boat. We did it. Let's, uh, let's talk about the minute while we're at it, because we're going to be doing some filler fights for the next 18-ish uh, minutes. Wow, these or, exactly are pretty now. tough, actually. Oh, are they now? <laughs> Actually, yeah, these are unminute are. If you have, like, minimum defense on your Espeon, and you get crit by every single attack, you can <laughs> die. You can die. It is possible. It's the only thing that can kill you is the Duskull. <laughs> it has happened. 
or it has <laughs> Wait, it has? It, no, sorry. I, I was just saying it is possible. It has never happened. There's a lot of things that can happen in this game, and quite a few of them have happened before, so... Also, failed Manip is screwing me over, because apparently Espeon's minus special attack, good job. Yep, mine yeah, mine has 67 special attacks, so I already missed his exact... We did it! Perfect! My, my, my I didn't chat. Adamant. <laughs> Off to a great start. <laughs> like, I killed the Zigzagoon, and I flinched the second Zigzagoon, so I am very Unbelievable. Alright, well, who's wow. the winner? <laughs> Well, Back it up. Great turn, Billy. Yeah, uh, the Minip thing. Minip is only, it's like, it's fairly new. It's only like a few years old, but uh, for the longest time, we used to just reset for good special attack and SPM, but Minip uh, gives us uh, a much better yeah. way to get good stats, and it also lets us choose a hidden power for SPM, which uh, is really helpful because SPM doesn't have a very big move pool, so hidden power really helps you cover your weaknesses. You also get some coverage from whoever your secondary poke is, and all four of the racers here are running a different secondary, but it's we not actually, a full coverage, so... In between yeah. the four of us, we have three different hidden power types on Espeon. I have electric. I'm using grass. And then the rest I'm of us it. are using fire. Right. Yep. Yeah, so fire's good yes, for... The rats are basically... One is gonna catch Bayleaf, one's gonna catch Quill, one's gonna catch Croc, and then I am catching none of the three. So kind of all four possible scenarios for the choice that you get in this town coming up. Yep. Pretty much. Except Makuhira, I guess. <laughs> Which is the, the technical nope. first shadow you're able to capture. Nope. Yeah. Makuhira nope. is a tutorial shadow, uh, so, we're, so we'll get into shadow Pokémon a little more as we go through the run, but... Shadow Pokemon are this game's version of Wild Encounters, because uh, Coliseum is a very differently designed game from anything that you've seen so far at PSR Marathon, and yeah, we'll all be catching different ones, or in Ryzekin's case, he's just going to kill every single Shadow Poke, because you can kill them or catch them. Uh, yeah. I don't want to spoil it, but that is not true. Yeah, he's technically not doing no snacks. He's technically just using Umbreon. Never oh. before seen oh, Umbreon okay. any percent route. Oh, really? Never let them okay. measure. Just kind of an Umbreon all main oh, route that oh, I threw together maybe. last week. <laughs> no spoilers sure, on why. It's like it's it's eighty five percent the same as no snags, except we'll be eighty five catching some stuff at the end. Is a yeah. Eighty five percent is a very important number. Uh, in this run for some of the runners here. <laughs> yeah, for some of us, it's 90. We'll yep, talk about 90. that later. It's it's fine. Oh, I have 95. Yeah, 95, 90, right? Yeah. 95 is basically 100, if you think about it. <laughs> yeah, it's basically the same, right? Very close. Round it up. By the way, best pro will Rui? No. Oh, gosh. No, lies. Uh, so... So we're gonna Where's be naming Alton Rui. Back me up? <laughs> we're gonna be perhaps naming Rui, but we don't name uh, our character, so we just go with the default name Wes, and that's part of the manip for the starters. So we will be playing as Wes and perhaps A or Rui. Any ditch Rui runs could do that right now. Oh, true. Give uh, give some of the other runners some help. We'll add a fifth uh, runner. It's fine. <laughs> I'll just name her Rui. Super potions. We get free potions. It's awesome. And we're gonna need every single, every single healing item we get early on. Healing items are pretty tight for some of us. <laughs> yes. Oh gosh, I can imagine that. <laughs> yeah, you actually spend a lot of money in in all of these routes, so uh, money gets tight in some of them, but. It's mostly that you have to buy your items early because you get a lot of money later, but it's really slow There's to... no shops to go to, yeah. Yeah. So we're going to be doing our shopping for, for... Actually, we're doing two main shopping trips for the most part, if I'm not mistaken. And the main one is coming up here. We're, we're all doing the first shopping trip at the same time because it's a shop in this city. 
And I think all of, I think maybe Juan and Razkin, you think they're both shopping in Agate, but I think I guess Ava would too, but I have two shopping trips and I think Juan and Razkin also have two more after that. Cause we actually visit one of the shops twice to get extra items. Yeah. But either way, we're gonna go to the Coliseum because our gracious mayor has uh directed us to go there and enter a Coliseum challenge. But unfortunately, as you see on Zeke's screen, uh, we can't actually do that, so we turn around. An encounter. Okay. Villainous well, team. I'm just going to quickly talk about the shops again. So we're, we're buying X items. That, that's what we're doing. And uh, all of us except Ryzenkin are buying a Great Ball because a Great Ball is greater than a Pokeball. <laughs> Won't okay. Ryze also do it, because he may or may not be catching stuff? Oh, I guess. I don't remember. That's fine. Alright. I can just hang on to the Pokeballs until uh, we get the Master Ball later. Oh. Not to spoil one, too much, but there is a Master Ball on, in this game. One of us is unlike the others. Just want to give a quick shout out to Andy in the chat with the slowest verified any percent run, which I think clocks oh, in at go. seven hours. I think I had All to right. verify it. Come on, I beat the game way slower than that as a kid. Didn't I? I... Did you the slowest any percent run? I didn't beat the game as a kid. <laughs> so I don't know why I'm here. As you beat the game as an adult, which is the same thing, I think. I uh, just unneeded Fair to enough. say, mine's actually ten hours. So I'm three hours slower than the second slowest. Oh wow. Yeah. Okay. Look, you guys don't you guys don't know the meaning of slow until you've seen surf animation thirty times in a row. Sure. Oh, Zeke admitted it. Put that on the record, y'all. We're, we're we're not hiding it. It's it's not a secret. <laughs> I was gonna say it's not exactly uh... <laughs> Yeah, not not a secret. Fair enough. Uh if anyone's wondering why these fights are super slow and why we're I don't know if anyone else is having a hard time with these, but I am. It's because am. Our, our stats suck. <laughs> They're not supposed to suck. These yeah. are usually, you can usually one hit kill everything with Espeon if it's a plus special attack, but ours are not, so. We should one shot everything. Except for Juan. One, 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 right, she one. cheats. I have 76 special attack. I don't think that's great. <laughs> no, that's, usually that's have like a, 88. Good it's, enough. Minus. it's a minus nature. Uh. So essentially, you would try to be taunting oh. things with Umbreon to skip animations, since you trust Espeon to one-hit everything, but we can't do that, so we're kind of just biting yeah. doing fights a little differently. Yeah, right now is probably the only time you'll see Bayleaf in the lead, so enjoy it. Okay, so I'm going to buy two X-Speeds and a bunch of X-Specials. What are you guys buying? X-Specials. A lot of them. Quite a few. So yeah, there's going to be backup save files, so these Espeons are eventually going to actually, like, have a decent amount of power to them. But the backup save file is going to be coming up in about 10 minutes, so we're going to be playing out our next uh, three battles, I would say, with <laughs> these Espeons that we have on hand right now. And uh... these Umbreons are going to just kind of exist if you're wondering why we're talking to random npcs it's because that's how this game advances plot you just talk to random npcs yeah, yeah. you can't actually leave town without talking to the the shop npcs there's two that you can talk to the guy yeah. up top you could talk to but there's also one on the bottom floor but the top guy is obviously closer to where we buy stuff so we just talk to that guy at the table yeah they let you go back to the, the outpost i believe to buy pokeballs from the yeah, guy who runs the place. Well, you can come back, yeah. you just can't buy Pokeballs until you talk to them. Yep. I'm gonna see some more NPCs. Just kinda... I, think... I was gonna say, I think you can't leave the town. I think there's a, a menu that I learned. Yeah. Without that, talking to them. Uh, that's ridiculous. Yeah. That's awesome, though. That's it's so... awesome, yeah. <laughs> Better than a lot of uh, standard Pokemon game programming. <laughs> Oof. Yeah, except standard Pokemon games let you skip animations. Haha. 
Hey, the animations are beautiful. They might be a little slow for for Look, you. I, but... I've seen some people talk about like compare this game's animations to Sword and Shield, and like <laughs> Sword and Sh Sword and Shield, it, 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 maybe it's not a masterpiece, but uh, this game's graphics are ugly. <laughs> they're definitely. I mean, they're using good. a lot of. They're fine. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we get our first look at our hero. Wait, there wait. Is. Uh, Ranger, turn up the volume. Or, or, no, this this theme's gonna up. play for like three seconds. <laughs> worth it. Worth it. It's worth it. <laughs> anyway, if you ever wondered, uh, if you ever wanted to see a banana with a ball on his head, there he is. <laughs> I like that. Right. Told you I would. Hey, I'm yeah. Mirby, right? With bad stats, it's gonna be funny. Or oh, not Mirby, no. I meant uh, the yeah, the yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll try to, yeah. I'll try to notify you whenever Salsa's is coming up, Ranger. These might be a disaster. These two fights coming up. <laughs> At least you won't die. Um, actually, there are ways to die, so I probably shouldn't say that. But I believe in y'all. Well, I think we have uh, Frozen from Rise Again, or his streams frozen. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah, it's not on my end though. Not sure what's going on. Kinda noticed that throughout the marathon there's always like one screen that's kinda having problems. Yeah. But I'm not sure. Hopefully we'll be able to sort it shortly. Yep. Oh, yeah. Well I totally forgot about this. No one's mentioned it, but uh Espeon comes with return and it has like eighty something base power to start with, so it actually has like a decent physical move even though its attack sucks. And we will be using it a little bit because uh, it does have a little slightly faster animation than uh, its psychic type moves do. Yeah. And we're going to see a lot of those types of animation saves throughout the run. One that we also missed because nobody seems to have a decent Umbreon or a de decent Espeon where you use Taunt, as one of y'all already mentioned. Yeah, you'll be my... seeing Taunt used a lot At by least I finally. Out of whisker, so. At least my Espeon is adamant, so I don't have to worry about these returns. Let's go! <laughs> we take those, we take those. Yeah, it's a 29 IV adamant. <laughs> what? Amazing. It's basically neutral. <laughs> it's not, though, it's still worse. <laughs> Wait, I said basically, come on. Close enough. Anyway, the Makuhita has guaranteed catch. But you would never catch it because it's Makuhita and it sucks, except the new route catches it because it's yeah. useful. It's yeah, the new uh, two Kolaba routes catch it. I don't think that anyone's running the. Are you running the newest route, Ava? I don't think so. Only Xarian's uh, running. No, so I'm not using Xarian's route. I'm running uh, Raskin's most recent yeah. route. That was like a really recent update. Um, yeah. I haven't, I haven't yeah, actually the route used, I think, would pretty much need. Really strong Quilabas, so it'd be a lot yeah. better maybe when we get RNG minute for secondary pokes. Yeah, which is being worked on. I'm also not sure if it's it is, that marathon yeah. safe. Um, yeah, Balton, uh, I think, is the only active runner who does catch Makuhita. Oh, okay. Okay, wait. I just have this because it's happened to me way too many times. If you have a perfect special attack Espeon, which you always would in a normal run, there's like a less than one percent chance that Makuhita lives anyway, which is really funny uh, and awesome when it happens because so we're all kind of holding our breath, waiting for it to live tonight with our weak espions. All, all <laughs> shadows have didn't fully, live, so all shadow Pokemon have fully randomized stats, and they're the only pokes in the game to have that. So there'll be a lot of weird ranges on shadows, just because their stats are random. Yeah, I want to add. Uh, we all look like we're you know pretty close, right? We're on the same fight, but as soon as Kale comes, it's just all gonna change. Oh no. Yeah, uh, he's the gatekeeper, but he he gatekeeps more than just the city. He's gonna gatekeep us from getting good times. Yeah. So, by the way, Zeke's gonna be the first one on his way to fight one of three trainers to exit the city, and oh they also God. provide the secondary. It's a jokes, fish. Jokes on him. It's Bailey is right by the house. True. Look at him. You can't tell me that's not a fish. I'm what just trying person? to clear one of these fights as fast as possible. I'm not catching no, any of them. Not the, not the person, the fishy he sent. Also, it's not the closest, but <laughs> it's just to make sure. it's kind of harder to kill, so I just use this one. And Kolaba also gives better EVs for defeating it. 
Yeah, Bayleaf is a tinky poke. Uh, all yeah, of these it three. Body, pokes. I think it's body slam and sense of this. So. Yeah, it has, it's really annoying to kill, Gosh. no matter what. That sounds it's, horrible. It, it's even annoying to catch because if you weaken it, it can heal itself. Yeah, it's so, terrible. So as you see. Juan just swapped the Great Ball with the Pokeball. Uh, oh yeah. Would you like to explain why you did that? So yeah. weird. So there's this glitch in this game where it tries to use a Master Ball, but if you just swap its slot, the game gets confused. And it's like, well, there's no, there's no Great Ball or any Pokeball used there, so it just won't even take it away. Yeah, you yep. can duplicate any balls infinitely, and it's cool. It's quite if useful. My, if my Espeon dies, I'm gonna be sad, but it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Yeah, that's why that I only bought one Great Ball because My they Espeon don't... died. Is it ever? <laughs> Wait, what? Really? <laughs> <Wait. laughs> it is. Uh oh. It's fine. I just, I just caught the, well. This is why we have backup saves. First death of the run, I guess. Someone it's died. Fine. It's fine. Yeah, Zeke. Oh. Zeke At least died. your XP won't wow. be messed up. My Espeon got double Shadow Rushed. I just got owned. <laughs> <laughs> you, well, that's what you get for going for Croc. Literally had nothing to do with my stats, I just got completely owned. Oh no. <laughs> so I'm gonna do an X item glitch here so I can finish off the quill. Alright, Rise again is gonna do the other glitch, so I guess you can go ahead and explain it. Yeah, so basically you can do this menu exploit where you can use a useless item on your ally, then use an X special or any other X item after that. X item will be applied to your ally instead of yourself. You can effectively have your Pokemon A boost Pokemon B, and vice versa. Yep, that's a feature that you see in more modern games, but it wasn't supposed to happen uh, in this one. But it's okay, we will gladly take it. I, I feel like I've checked it, but I don't remember. Can't you use X items on your ally in Gen 3, just not this game? Uh... No, it was so, not a thing until Gen okay, okay. That's the, yeah. I think. Okay. I, yeah, that makes the sense. The route would be possible, but it would be way longer um, if you couldn't do this glitch, especially for Umbreon. Oh yeah. gosh, old, old Umbreon yeah. roads are not my good. Cool, my would be mega runnable if this Espeon was runnable. <laughs> I didn't check my stats. Is it? I guess I will before I reset. Uh, it was fifty attack, sixty special attack, and like fifty good oh. speed. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. I don't know if I should check the Bayleaf strat stats because um, I have no, um, no, nothing to compare with. I'm not going to. Do you, want, do you want to talk about our secondaries and what stats they will have once you reset? Yeah, let's do that. All right, I'll just go The quickly. secondary that I would have is uh, usually Manipped along with the Espeon because they're kind of a package deal. Umbreon, basically, it actually needs good special attacks, surprisingly, even though it's not really much of an attacker. Aside from that, you kind of just want... Low special defense compared to Espeon. Once your level gap grows later in the game, you'll end up shifting the AI to want to attack the Umbreon, which is actually a lot better than hitting Espeon. And you need good speed for certain couple boss fights late game, but it also helps win ties and things in the early game. Okay, well, I'm going to be my... switching over to that backup now with a good Espeon and Umbreon. Yeah, my my Krokana is it's a little bit weird um, for the marathon, but I think it's gonna be uh, a little easier for me to use in a marathon. Uh, it's basically max speed, which is super helpful to outspeed a bunch of stuff. Cause uh, if you have like below average speed, Croc is like a has like a lot of problems later in the run. So it has pretty much max speed and it has really high special attack and a little above average attack with okay defenses. Yep. Alright, Ava, your turn. Uh, oh, my turn for what? Uh, just to... What's your Kualava? Oh, my, my Kualava is uh, hasty, um... Very good speed, uh, average special attack, um, good attack, um... Okay-ish defenses, uh, nothing special. Right. Um... I didn't go out of my way to get something incredibly broken. So... Uh. I can go next. I have a naughty uh, max attack Bailey, and it's still not good. I'll be honest. <laughs> <laughs> but it's about so as good Nadi as it can is, get. Yeah, Nadi's really. one of the top natures, uh, so... Do y'all want me to explain that, or do y'all want to do it? 
Well, I, I have to bring it up for my croc anyway, so I'm just gonna... Um, yeah, you got it then. Well, the, the, the little purple tube, the, the heart gauge, uh, you need to lower it to get EXP. Once two bars are down, you start getting EXP. And uh, depending on your nature, different things will lower it by different amounts, so... We normally want good natures for that to help purify our stuff faster, but also to gain EXP faster. Uh, there's a bunch of ways to lower the gauge. Um, one of them is you enter hyper mode, which I guess I'll explain later, and you call out of it, which uh, lowers it by a bunch. And I'm going to have to do that once because uh, my nature is naive and it just requires me to call once. But uh, the cool thing about hyper mode is uh, you get uh, a million crits with Shadow Rush, which is cool, but you can, I think, only use Shadow Rush. And you can't use healing items on a Pokemon in hyper mode. Well, I just got crit by Kale, so oh, nice. we're in there. Which All right. Poke, which poke got good crit? I, I just crit Kale. Get on. Bailey. Oh, okay. Bye, Bailey. Oh, it's please okay. not ask Yeah. Yeah, it's actually not that big of a deal if your shadow dies here because it doesn't start gaining XP around this point. Yeah. This for it's only getting for blood. They just crit my Espeon! I can't oh, oh, no way. You have to reset then, I suppose. Wait, wait, Punishment for using using Bayleaf. Wow, we were ahead. That's what you get for using the plant fish. So, my Espeon was Ava's being bullied. Mode now. It survived. Oh, this is so bad. <laughs> Look, I, I didn't expect to lose my lead this soon. I expected to have oh. it for at least like a couple more minutes. but <laughs> I believe in you. You can do it, Juan. I'm glad I Dude. healed, because I got, just got strength up before I Dude, fur it. My, my fur you, you got see, completely I, owned. Uh, everyone's on the same fight, but... You guys, you guys don't even want to know what it. I just did to, to that. Dude, I murderfied that fur. I crit it with confusion. I safety healed with 50 HP. I crit it with confusion, dude. Yeah, I also, still saved, died. I also I, safety healed with 50 HP. <laughs> dude, I crit and the I fur with crit. confusion, and then it oh. hit itself in confusion twice in a row and died. Incredible. I just, yeah, fur it is that fight. I just destroyed Kale. As you can see, sometimes it's super easy, and sometimes Kale goes uh, awesome mode on you and destroys you. I love yeah. Kale going awesome mode. Yes. Furret is is at best a three shot with confusion, and and all sorts of things can go wrong. So, and not even task even with good espions, can Only be a speed Mayon. tie or just outspeed you still. It can be a range to three shot. Random shadow stats, yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. So yeah, the hardest fight in the run, and uh, yeah, Furt isn't Furt isn't good. It just is way higher level than us, and it comes with eighty base powers uh, stat, Strength. which is uh, yeah. unfortunate. But it can just use Helping Hand a bunch, which is what it used turn one on me. So uh, I literally basically got like perfect fight, and I got to call out a hyper mode. So like, wow. <laughs> I'm, uh, All right, Zeke. All right. I'm, I'm so sorry. It's okay. When I have I to start suck. watching surf animation, I'll fall behind again. It's fine. So, yeah. So Zeke's got his one call done now. and I don't think anyone else is calling. I, I think, I think I Ava did call. earlier. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I tried, I tried to farm another call on CDOT too, but didn't get Too anything. hasty. Called up Rion just to stall a turn. Yeah, <laughs> he did it. <laughs> C dot was stuck in bite, and I wasn't gonna risk biting it and dying. Our race, that is okay. Everything is fine. Yeah, uh, <laughs> so your this game, game in this space. This game has a now? million ranges, which is awesome. There's just ranges everywhere for fun. The developers. Yeah, no, we, really we got, we got you. So oh. Ryzikin's progressing the plot for us now because Zeke's feed has disappeared for knows how long it's okay oh no it's not your fault so this, no at this know, part of the game if i was running any johto starter at all i would be thinking a lot about how to purify it but with this route i'm just kind of body da went through yeah so purification uh it you need to get all the way down to the end of your shadow bar to purify your pokes once we get to the relic forest. Uh, that's not the milestone that really matters the most because certain pokes want to get experience at certain points or to start getting experience. So Ava kind of wants some sort of experience in our next uh, dungeon, uh, the Coliseum. Yeah. 
My special attack Zeke is bad can. enough that I my special attack is bad enough that I need this XP. Yeah, I'm I, I don't get need this XP, Tisler. but yeah. I'm getting experience uh, on the fight after that, which nice. is kind of the standard average of where you would normally get it. Depending on your nature, uh, you can get it earlier, depending on uh, your stats and stuff. But... Yeah, so you can purify in a couple number of different ways. Um, one is by using them in battle. Another is by calling. Another is by leaving them in daycare. Um, You're walking, aren't you? We don't use yeah. daycare, obviously, so... <laughs> we really Only 100% need... uses daycare. Okay, that's true, huh? And, and sense. Love some sense. Yeah. That is true. You don't have access to sense until after mount battle. Yeah. Unlike an XD, uh, you usually use sense to purify your Teddy Ursa in the beginning. Yeah, because you need it purified really fast in that game. Uh, in this game, there's a lot of battles between now and purification. Thought it would be really funny if you had to carry a level 30 to the halfway point. I mean, Bayleaf and Umbreon are going to be effectively playing a level 30 poke for the rest of the game anyways. I mean, what? You can't be giving Croc this much credit, man. Okay, fine. Croc is playing a level 31 poke. Yeah. <laughs> because it has a move that hits two turns in one turn. Whoa. Yeah, exactly. No, Bayleaf has that as well. Don't count yeah, Bayleaf out. Yeah, but it can miss, so it's not the same. If it actually hits. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Too. Uh, pretty much all sh or most Shadow Pokemon have uh, items. Uh, our elemental starters have an item that power up their elemental moves. I have a Mystic Water. Uh, I have a Charcoal. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I have something. I don't know what it is. Miracle Seed. Miracle, Miracle Seed. Yeah. 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 That thing. Come on, Juan. How do we know more about Poke than you do? No. <laughs> he hates fish. He doesn't like the grass fish. <laughs> grass fish. All right. Actually, Bailey's a frog. Okay, so, so if Croc is a fish and Bayleaf is a fish. Is Quill no, a fish? No, it's not a fish. <laughs> no, no, Quill, Quill, Quill's a badger. It's a honey badger. He likes honey. Also, uh, Juan's doing some strange movement there to get an extra walk cycle of purification. Uh, can be helpful. Yeah, that's what that strange movement was. Yeah, it's the difference between me getting XP one fight sooner or one fight later. Nice. The thing about the Colosseum fights is that you get healed in between every fight. It's good. Man, I barely- I still have to go get the gear and you guys are in the Colosseum. <laughs> Man, didn't, you got owned by Kale, it's fine. You'll be, you'll be <laughs> yeah, back. Yeah, you have an excuse. Better Kale than like... I don't know... Uh, Burma? Burma? Any, oh, don't, don't any, curse any, it, don't curse it. Any Come other on. fight? I think... Hey, yeah, I am the master of the cursed block. I am gonna curse whatever I would like to- I don't Dude. even know what I just said there. That was weird. Anyways. Dying on, dying on Perma is definitely like... No, dying on um, Kale is definitely the fastest death, I would say, just because yeah. the save is just right there. <laughs> True. Alright, Ava has just re-entered hyper mode, which is really good. Poison sucks. <laughs> Why we cursed that yet? block more than me? Alright. All right, Zeke will now be in hyper mode for the foreseeable future, I guess. Is what I'll call so it. Hopefully, unless something goes horribly wrong. Oh yeah, Juan, would you like yeah. to explain what can go wrong? Yes. So while you're in hyper mode, right? It's, if you use Shadow Rush, it's about ninety-one percent to crit. Um, so it's you, you know we we ride around at you. You're expected to crit, right? With I just missed. I just missed a crit. That's cool. Thanks, man. <laughs> You're expected to probably miss like Thanks. two to three per run, um, with, as Croc and Bailey. But there's also this other thing that can happen, where when you call, your Pokemon comes to its senses and a bit of the shadow bar goes down. But the developers thought it would be great to add a one in two fifty six chance for it to do it on its own. You don't even get the shadow bar progress. It is great. It's supposed it to be helpful. Really, really funny. They did it just to troll. I don't see any other reason why. Yeah, it's awesome. 
One out of 256s in Pokemon. Name a more iconic duo. Um, and so, yeah, in my practice runs to this, I, I got two runs in a row where I got the 1 and 256 twice in the same run. Wait, I have a more iconic duo. It's Surf Animation falling asleep. Okay, yeah. fair enough. Fair. I, yep. Can't beat that. One I mean, there is a precedence of getting the 1 in 256 in Marathon, so I think I got it <laughs> in both of my previous Call of Marathon runs. So, if anyone's gonna get it, I guess it's gonna be me. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, in an ideal world, with like a task route, you wouldn't even get hyper mode. You would just crit everything. Oh, yeah, it adds an extra like uh, four seconds of text in, in a fight every turn where it's like, hey, your Pokemon's in hyper mode. Yep. Okay. So, Juan mentioned something where you would route around just critting everything because you're you know, like almost guaranteed to crit everything. Uh, but my route gets like a million extra X specials, so in a lot of cases, I will use X specials to avoid. Uh, the chance of not critting, just because it's a Lame. little bit safer and basically the exact same speed. Just because I can. I don't think it, nobody else really does that in their routes, but... I don't my know if we gets... really explained, like, the potential drawbacks of Hyper Mode. When you're in Hyper Mode, you basically can't use items on it at all. Yeah, no You're items. constantly going to be taking damage every time you use Shadow Rush. So, the section coming up, it's going to be kind of important for these guys to manage their health one healing machine at the very bottom of the building. Oh gosh, yeah. 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 If you guys Ideally, like stairs. There is like three floors or something, in pir four floors in Pyrite building. And... A lot of stairs. You, yeah. A lot of loading zones. If you're zones. in hyper mode, that one healing machine on the bottom floor is the only way you're gonna heal that quill back to full. Hey, you can heal at the PC. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you know, if you feel All like right. wasting time. Oh, well, actually, maybe we should have said this in the beginning, but um, Kulava is clearly the fastest for this game. Oh, I'm Has sorry. the record was, by a fair bit. Is um, that not obvious? <laughs> also, Kulava does this funny thing uh, where it gets out of hyper mode because Flame Wheel is better than Shadow Rush, so about halfway through pirate building, uh, Ava will get her Kulava out of hyper mode and start using Flame Wheel instead of Shadow Rush. Assuming just because, things go well. Early. Just because uh, stab and uh, its special attack is higher than its Natural. physical attack, which Shadow Rush is physical. And, yeah. uh, oh, recoil know, is a nice bonus too. No recoil, faster animations. Uh, there's a lot of stuff in that area that's actually weak to fire, so it's actually. Uh, Kulava is the best poke for that area just because a lot of stuff's weak to fire. Uh, yep. Obviously, obviously, different natures get you. Uh, flame wheel at different times because you get it uh, I think when the second to last bar is empty on your heart gauge so it's a, it takes a while but uh, it's the last bar isn't it or, oh yeah when you well, have one bar left I guess yeah and it's 80% gone yeah so everyone's gonna gain their stab move at that point I believe uh, I don't actually know when Bailey gets it I assume it is uh, yeah, yeah oh. it doesn't really matter when we get it. We won't be using <laughs> it. You're not we, using it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we well. hope to keep hyper mode until we have to purify it, because yeah, Shadow Rush crit is our strongest move. Funny thing about hyper mode is if you die, you lose it. <laughs> so uh, there's a small chance in a couple of places, uh, mostly Quilab and Croc, sometimes Bailey, but there's a couple of places where we could our, our secondaries could faint somewhere, and then we'd have to like just live without hyper mode for a while. Mm -hmm. Or maybe switch to Metatite as well, sometimes. <laughs> yeah, I mean, or Umbreon. Yeah. Umbreon's fine. <laughs> Umbreon doesn't have to worry about hyper mode. Yeah, no, I don't think Umbreon can die. Umbreon's about... Yeah, but it's can about... it kill anything, though? That's the real question. Killed sure a Natu in this segment, and it's it has... gonna kill a Ninkata here. It has stab okay, bite. Yeah. Bite's more powerful in confusion for some reason. Wait, really? Oh yeah, no, it's 60 in, like, earlier gens. 50? 50? Oh. Uh. Yep, so Quilava's the fastest. Now let's talk about second fastest. It's kind of up in the air. It's it's most likely Croc on a good run. But Umbreon well, good, is, like, good, 40 good seconds croc. off. Good Croc good is croc. significantly faster, but it'd have to be a really good Croc. Like It's also a myth if they exist. I don't know. Yeah, good Crocs technically aren't real. 
but they can, you know, sometimes uh, like a rift will open to another universe and like a good fish will kind of hop into your game. It's weird. So, uh, how about Bayleaf? We don't talk about Bayleaf here. Fair Bayleaf enough. and Underground Bayleaf. are actually surprisingly close to one another. Yeah, the routes are very similar. Had as similar. Much, uh, optimization as Umbreon has. Mm -hmm. yeah. Sounds because... like Fire and Leaf Green runs bad. It's because Bailey and Umbreon have no good stats except defense. Yeah, and yeah. the AI here likes to target things with worse defense, so they're they're not great as well for tanking hits. They will be a little bit in the late game. Yeah. Ah, uh, first surf animation of the run coming from Juan. I Let's go, you did it. One. You didn't think you'd see it from Bailey, but you did. Amazing. <laughs> Incredible. I hit every range in that fight, get on. Dude, I was able to I... do my entire taxes during that animation. I had the <laughs> slowest Coliseum of all time because I couldn't get hyper mode. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that's yeah. so, I mean, there's, there's a bunch it's of ranges. It's cool, you're fine. In that last fight, especially in the Coliseum, there's a bunch of ranges. For me, three of the, of the Monza ranges, I think two is for the rest of you guys. Uh, the uh, Deli Bird and the Goldeen are ranges. And uh, I actually hit all night, so I'm, I'm I'm looking pretty good right now. So yeah, we're here beginning pirate building. Uh... Oh no! <laughs> I am I've not. Already, I've already Bill missed my is two. coming up soon. But... I've missed my two shadow rush crits for the run, which means I won't miss any for the rest of the run. That's how that works. Wait, which yep. shadow rush crit did you miss? I missed one. <laughs> oh, sir, skip. Okay. Yeah, well, Cirsca sucks because okay. the pine the pine co's arranged. So if I miss the pine co range, then uh, this fight will just take a million years. For Any fun. biters? Bite? No, no bide. <laughs> the pine co knows bide, and it's faster than it using other moves. Let's go. Bayleaf isn't last anymore. Woo! <laughs> I am. Just because we we had hyper mode. Oh, as you yeah. can see, hyper mode saves a lot of time. As Ava was unable to get hyper mode early and. It really yeah, slows down the fights. If you're stuck outside of hyper mode for like a significant amount of time, you just lose. You're just like leaking time. It's incredible. Yeah, it's so. We'll it make was... up the time everywhere else, but it this was so matter. miserable. Lit up yeah. Probably one of the worst coliseums I've had. E even if she gets really unlucky, Kolava will save a million years in the second half of the run because it's the only one of the three secondaries that can actually one hit KO stuff. Assuming I hit the, the move. The move? Yeah, but it, it, are, it kills stuff doing, with flame wheel. It, it doing, kills stuff with flame wheel, it's fine. Like we're, we're, we're not talking about the inaccurate moves, they don't exist. Fair <laughs> there is there is no fire blast. Fire blast is a myth. Yeah, basically, as long as Kulava gets flame wheel, it's not really going to need to keep hyper mode for more than like half of this building usually, so it can optimally get by without having to run back to the heal machine. The other two can do it as well, it's just kind of harder to get that optimal RNG going on. Yeah, but a lot of the trainers here have random AI and some have big damage moves. Oh yeah, that's a, that's another funny thing. Like, pretty much all the trainers in like the first half of this game have completely random AI, but there's like a couple of weird ones that don't, which is really funny. But pretty much everything you'll see in the first half is completely random AI, and then it will like shift to a better, like semi-random AI, and then by the end it'll be using uh, optimal moves all the time. There's a couple yeah. trainers in this building that have smart AI. Yeah, yeah, it's really weird. Yeah. And this yeah, is the... the first time that I've seen some of these move animations. It's the first time I've seen Bayleaf. <laughs> Here, wait. Oh, wait. just since we haven't uh, bullied Croc, there's actually more active Bayleaf runners than Croc runners. I'll put that out there. <laughs> it's, it's true, it's true. Nobody, we, we don't talk about Croc, we've been trying to bury <laughs> Croc away so nobody can find it. It's just not worth it. If you're trying to do a meme category, run Bailey. If you're trying to get a good time, run Quill. There's no reason to run Croc anymore. That is a category extension. Mm, the, no, the JP community so. actually really loves Croc. They they refuse to kind of adopt the Quill They're, stuck, they're away. stuck in 2016. Uh, Balton, I think, is the only JP runner that has to use Kolava, and he's mentioned a couple times where he likes Croc, he thinks the Croc run uses more skill. It's the only thing that he says it's not that true. is it's wrong. Not it's, it's completely it's not wrong. True. <laughs> anyway, what uses I don't, the most skill? I don't know if anyone's ahead of me. Bailey, clearly. Bailey. Honestly, probably true. 
this fight that I'm in is really funny because it has good AI, except the AI is dumb because it will force uh, its mons to use, uh, to waste a turn using, um, what is it? Focus, Focus energy. energy. Yeah. Because uh, it, they can't one hit KO anything, so they'll use a status move before they attack. It's like a. It's whatever. A gimmicky AI. There's some AI that actually, like, plays oh, well, no. and then there's some idiot. that <laughs> prioritize really gimmicky moves, so. I targeted the wrong poke, so it's not even gonna use focus energy. I'm an idiot. It's fine. This doesn't really cost me anything, but it was just dumb. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Barboat <laughs> in that fight doesn't have focus energy, but the others do, so. Yep. Yeah, the game loves to use status moves if it can't well, kill. Well, it crit me anyway, so. It's good to it... abuse, especially with Umbreon, because you can taunt it if you know it's gonna use the status move. Just, That's one really nice wanna... thing about Umbreon, especially when we get to the late. Uh, late trainer AI. I just want to mention about that Talo fight. Um, there's like a, there's a one in sixteen that Talo survives confusion with one health, and it knows Endeavor. So if it uses Endeavor on your Shadow, and then your Shadow then he... uses Shadow Rush, you just die, and it's really funny. It's quite hilarious. If you're good enough speed, at, at least with Bull, I'm not sure about the other routes. Yeah, you're only good enough speed can outspeed it. <laughs> yeah, uh, if you're good enough speed, you can outspeed them, then just double target, and you're completely safe. Which Mike Quill is. Uh, I'm doing safety strats, I'm just going to heal, I don't care. I refuse I'm also to die. Gonna, and... I'm also going to do safety strats for building, for sure. I refuse sure. to die in pirate building I, on Marathon. There's I, no I will way. also heal. <laughs> yeah, so well, I, just... I, I missed the range, thankfully it didn't, <laughs> didn't use it, you still get energy. I might just do hyper mode strats because I don't really feel like dying. <laughs> so these two fights suck for me because it's, there's three electric types out of four, and they all hurt Croc a lot because Croc oh, is yeah. bad and sucks. Yeah, this Magnemite guy is especially bad for Croc. Mm -hmm. This is where Croc basically takes its biggest damage. <laughs> if you miss Sh Shadow Rush crit, it just owns you with Thunder Shock, and you might think Thunder Shock sucks, but Croc sucks more, so it takes like half health from it. And then even if Magnemite goes well, you gotta deal with those Psybeam rolls that can confuse or crit and be really annoying. And then the Remoraids are range, so if you miss the range, you might hate yourself in confusion, and, and, you know. It's quite funny. Oh, wait, I need to heal. Got the Remoraid range, thankfully, so I don't have to worry about that. And I can possibly nice. flinch Magnemite. Yeah, I was in range to die to Larvitar Thrash, so... I almost died. <laughs> I just, I just min rolled the Remory, and it's cool. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 really it was bad. catching up, y'all. It sucks to miss in confusion ranges because uh, Shadow Rush is such a long move animation. How how yeah. long was Croc the meta, by the way? I don't quite remember. It, it was it was the meta for like five or six years Four at least, five. dude. Okay. Like it was forever. It was so dope. Yeah. It was, I'm, I'm, pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it was just the meta since like the run, since the first runs. People were just like, surf hit two pokes, that made it good. <laughs> Insane logic. Well, it hits two turns in one turn, it has to be good. Yeah, there's an yeah, area really. coming up, uh, Mount Battle, where it's kind of all rock and ground Pokemon. Um, and so yeah. Croc just gets through it really fast. It's you know, kind of the only section in the game ah. where Croc is clearly faster. It is the only. And it's not even clearly faster because Quilava is even that slow at it if it's a good Quill. Yeah. Yeah. But Quil th that section was kind of, I think, one of the main reasons why no one really considered yeah. Quilava. It, yeah. it was just weird because Quilava, depending on stats, can have a tough time in that area. So I think people are just like, I don't want to run Typhlosion through all these rock types. So I just won't. The fools. I said rock types, but there's only like three rock types. They're all ground types. People were just stupid back then. I think what kind of came along with RNG Manip was just a slowly better understanding of how the AI worked in each fight and how we yeah. can best kind of take control of the situation. Make it not as hellish of a split. It's for Quilaba. Oh yeah. A lot of having dig is a big help though, because you can kind of just dodge oh, yeah. out of trouble in a lot of yeah. cases. Quilava gets dig, so it can just like totally work around the AI in a lot of cases. Yeah, Quill gets actual moves. Uh, I don't know why. I can't really say the same about all the other pokes, but that's okay. <laughs> well, they have X specials. Funny. Like, like at least Bailey doesn't have a 
like a good attack stat, so like it, it makes sense that it doesn't get good offensive moves, but like Croc has a good attack stat. If it learned physical moves, it wouldn't suck so much, but it comes with Bite and Surf, which are special for some reason. You get Slash. Yeah, but like in a million years. Shadow Rush is the only physical move you really get to abuse that high attack with. Yeah. Interestingly, Umbreon has a really slow early section, but it's going to gain a lot of ground over the others later. So we won't have to purify it. We won't have to do a second trip to the Relic Stone. I think that's like a minute and a half detour with the evolution and everything. Umbreon is probably better than you think it is. It's really not that terrible. It's only 40 seconds slower currently. If someone gets a better run, I think I could see a popping croc. Yeah, I just have to. What if someone gets a better croc run? Yeah, we're, just, we're talking about I, serious stuff here. Okay, okay, fair enough, running, fair enough. I just need to start running croc again. I'll bring it back. It's fine. That's not okay. Think, okay. Thank you. What are the odds of you running croc again, Zeke? Zero. Yeah, that's what I thought. I mean, we'll see how I this mean... marathon run goes. <laughs> yeah, what? I'm one out of two. I'm gonna lose. So. <laughs> just, oh. I'm just sandbagging. Well, you need to slow down so that you won't just like pass us by five minutes later. <laughs> yeah, Ava is probably the least practiced for sure. out of all of us, but yeah. she's got the fastest, so she can make up for yeah, it. Yeah, it's compensating, hopefully. You know, I haven't been able to practice for various reasons, or practice much for various reasons, but uh... You're doing great, and that's what matters. Yeah, so yeah. far it's still a close race. I'll just get lucky. Better the oh. race. We should talk about the goals we had, Randall. Do you want, do you want to talk about that? Oh, yeah! No, uh, but they'll see. spoil them. Everyone they'll has spoil. goals for this race. They'll spoil moves from later, come on. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, Zeke's goal is to hit all of his moves. I good, guess. Good. I like that, I like that. We, we'll get an act. We'll get a, a move that doesn't hit all the time later, except it will hit every time. So don't worry about it. Yeah, just don't worry about it. Wait, I, I just just uh, in case you need to laugh, uh, old Croc Rats got Blizzard, oh, gosh. which is really really funny. That is right. Anyway, yeah. we don't and get that know. anymore because it and... doesn't save any time and it misses all the time. <laughs> Croc special attack is so bad that it literally doesn't even KO anything when it has Blizzard. That's, There's like an Altaria that... and it can't even two hit the Altaria. <laughs> Blizzard strats were incredible. <laughs> we have a uh, Blizzard strats. I met a Wanli. Nice. For those who don't know, uh, moves that hit two Pokemon and not your ally, uh, they do half damage, which is why Surf sucks, and it, which is why Razor Leaf sucks. Yeah, so there are moves like Earthquake and I think Future Gens, maybe even Gen 3, it does 75% of hits to Pokemon, but in this game, it just it's always a full 100%. Yeah, you're seeing uh, Zeke in N1 just like take trips all the way back down to take the Steel Center. Anything. We yeah, yeah, talk about that. I'll have to do oh, another yeah. trip. Yeah. You, on average, want to do two trips or three, I believe, right? Two. Just two. Two. Yeah. Uh, ideal is, is for Bayleaf is one, but yeah, you can get in a situation where you do need to do three. <laughs> two, I think, is like the more common. You gotta get really lucky for just one. Every on route like can get away without the healing machine. It becomes really tight on confusion PP if you do that, though. So I didn't opt for it this time. It kind of depends on how the Yanma guy goes at the start of this section. You can always heal it because it's never in hyper mode. Yep. Smile. If you're wondering why it looks like I'm targeting weird things with sh with Shatter Rush, it's because Croc can't one hit KO anything anymore. Oh. <laughs> Oh, the number of pages for some of the fights. Yeah, everyone's got... Everyone is running off of some sort of notes. Yes. Uh, and some of these They're fights all... are going to get very complicated. Uh, <laughs> the first half's not that bad. Yeah. 
now it's a lot of random AI. Uh, Rambo's coming up with a kind of kind of complicated fight, I would say. Uh, but yeah, we'll we'll see. We'll see. The final fight only takes up about I don't know 25, 30 percent of the notes. Yeah. <laughs> the, the final only. two only literally take up like forty percent of my notes. <laughs> it's lovely. Yeah, because Arian used to have pace spins for the notes, so he had one pace spin for all the notes for all the fights, and then he had pace spin <laughs> specifically just for Evis and Esco. I think I've seen some of those, yeah. They were really funny because pace spins are already impossible to read. Pace spins are unreadable. <laughs> Until you try to decipher like four or in like ten different fight options. Yeah, I just, I just want to say that Croc not so bad that if this thing decided to use a uh, bubble beam on Croc, even though it's not very effective, oh. I would have had to go back and heal, because Croc sucks. A Bailey is a similar bow. But uh... <laughs> Bailey's supposed to be up. bad. Okay. Also, yeah, the, the final boss here is, uh... If, if you get crit by her, you basically just get completely destroyed, because she has a shadow that's pretty hard to KO. Or if you get a speed drop, that can also be quite bad. It's not so bad for me, but for yeah, Koala uh, especially, it sucks. Yeah, I love Firma. She's the best trainer in the game. Oh, oh man, AI. Oh, yeah. Speaking of Firma, Zeke's heading into the top of the building where he's going to be fighting two trainers. As they've taken Silva captive because he wanted to, like, save... Or... I don't even know. It's hacked near like, B or something. He's a weird haircut. They just decided to take him in because they look weird. I want to say Silva's trying to get back Plusle. Yeah. Okay. Does he even know about Plusle at this point? Yeah, he does. I don't sure think he does. Oh, he's, okay. he's a really smart guy. I think he just. Eh, whatever. Nobody actually knows the plot to this game. We're making it up as we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because here, uh, uh, here in PSR, we all uh, play Pokemon for the plot. Heck yeah. <laughs> Going to use a potion to heal 6 HP because I don't want to get owned. I'm sorry. <laughs> it, it's a bad look, but I need to. <laughs> there are Every... backup healing items throughout the run. So, Not to the second half. always nice. Sometimes your items or your shield items get pretty tight in the first half. Yeah, I've used a little more than I'd like, but not like an uncomfortable amount. It's not really good right now. Alright, going into Firma, we're going to try to hit a 50% range on Apom turn 1, and if we don't get it, we lose about 40 seconds, and it's a much scarier fight. Is it 50 or is it 916? It is a 50. It's a 50. Okay. And technically it's a little higher because you could also confuse oh, okay, like it yeah. itself. Oh yeah. And crit. Yeah. Yeah, Bayleaf can go for the same strap, but... If you just miss it, you kind of have a bad time. They look cool out of it. It's just bad. Yeah. I, I completely avoid this range by just doubling up on Apom. The reason this fight sucks is because you can't want to KO anything until you have a bunch of boosts. And even if you oh, have a yeah. bunch of boosts, you can't OHKO Mantine because it has one good stat and it's special defense. It looks really close right now. Me and Ava are kind of the same spot, and uh, Zeke oh and Ryzekin are in the same fight. So. Dude, Mantine did exactly one third of my health. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Missed the Apom range. Here we go. Dude, we'll there's be no hell. way I safe to heal here. I, I might as well safe to heal. There's an, I can't risk this. Oh my gosh. I want to die. This thing this thing crits twice as much as any other poke in the game. It's like it's I'm not even making that up. That's just true. That's very serious. <laughs> I can confirm from experience that Chris way more than anything else. Also like I can't confirm that from my experience. Me neither. 
<laughs> she she occasionally cheats and uses helping hand with her furry, which is she isn't supposed to do. Oh yeah. I think mathematically, Mantine has to be the Pokemon that crits the most because it gets the most turns. Yes. Usually more than for it. Okay. Well, Especially... you don't get to Mantine as often though, so it's still for it. Mm. <laughs> very true. Very true. <laughs> yeah. Th thankfully, uh, I have a good physical attacker, so I can actually KO Mantine with my shadow. Wow. Hey, Everyone else is. is... Oh, Everyone really? else suffers. Yeah. yeah. Here's <laughs> I get two shot two range. can go for a flinch, though, because Umbreon actually outspeeds this Mantine. Oh my goodness. Wait, that's possible? Mantine is Umbreon not at fast. this level, yeah. It's just a high level. It's not okay. a fast boat. Oh, yeah. Could still be speed tied, actually, so we'll see. Yeah, even with uh, minus one speed, you can st you can still potentially outspeed the Mantine if you're as Espeon. Yeah, hey, uh, there's weird AI in this fight if Fur and Yanma are alive because Fur will use Helping Hand, and the Yanma will use Sonic Boom, which is a devastating combo, of course. Yep, 20 HP to uh. 20, 20 HP. HP. Yeah. Also, yeah. I definitely wonder. Crit and my... flinched with bite, and that's nice. Oh my. I did my Amazing. end game a little weird. Let's see, if I, let's see if I can get the eight bomb range. So we're all in the same fight. It's a very Pretty slow good. fight, so... It happens. It has a really high crit rate with quick attack. I should have <laughs> saved to heal, but I didn't. It's fine. Alright, Firma down. There we go. So that means Umbreon's in the lead? I'll, I'll catch him, it's fine. Uh, sure, sure, sure. I'm not gonna catch him, I'll be honest. <laughs> not with that attitude. <laughs> What do you mean? You have. But I'll try my you're, best. You're gonna crush them out battle because there's so many ground types and you have a grass type. That is Zero. true. I may make up some time there. I didn't get the apron range. Scammed. Oh my goodness. Yeah, apron's really funny because it, it uses agility that would speed you, and then it uses astonish to flinch you forever. Yep. Except that was beyond. strong man time. <laughs> scared. This is the only time Astonish ever does significant damage. Astonish? Yeah, it's Astonish is scary strong. at other points in the run, too. Notably, Mirabi. Yeah, but that's not because of uh, But not because damage. of power. <laughs> no, no. Yeah. We'll see that later, when it definitely happens to more than one of us. There's other things that can also happen on Mirabi. Uh... Mm, no, I don't think so. Oh, if okay. we do, if we don't if we don't mention me. it, it won't happen, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, there's a 15 and 16 range, and if you miss it, you get destroyed. It's fine. Well, you just mentioned it, so it's gonna happen to someone now. What's gonna happen to me? I'm just taking a hit for everyone. <laughs> hey, nice. uh, Mantine down. I am a lot less scared. Whew. My Mantine is knocked down. I I'm, oh, no. I think I'm in range to die to a crit. Maybe. Do it, Dean. I was in range to die to a crit as well. Oh my goodness, it used supersonic on me. I did not I get crit. <laughs> I hate Coldeen. So victory. Used it on me, but missed. I'm happy. Unbelievable. <laughs> so I've also gotten past Perma now pretty much. Now it's just spamming attacks. If I hit myself in confusion, you'll get to see the, the funniest backup strat ever because it never works. What? If you use a second X special on SB, there's like a 0% range you kill Lanoon, so I go for it. Oh, 50 50, right? It's actually like a good range, but I never hit it. It's not 50 50, it's like, uh, I don't actually have it written down, but it's like uh, more like 1 in 3 or something around there. Like, it's good enough to go for, but it's not actually good. Well, I've had something interesting. So the fur, it was on its own, used the defense curl. Oh. It was the last big one. Usually it goes for quick attack. I'm guessing it didn't defense curl any time before. Yeah, probably. Okay, well Razkin's ahead of me, but we're we're getting some items here. We I, are you getting both those item boxes, Razkin? I don't actually no, I assume you are. Maybe not the ethers. Do not get the ethers, I just get the hypers. Okay, so there's an ether chest. I want the ethers. 
I think we all do other than... No, I guess Juan probably wouldn't, but... I need these. And the ethers are way further, so he's way more ahead of me now. Are you telling me Juan doesn't need to ether? Actually, interesting part about the no snags route. Yeah, I used to get the ether chest when I started routing this, but now I just teach two psychic moves to Espeon, so we don't have <laughs> <All> a right. psychic <laughs> PP. I forgot about that, it's awesome. I actually don't even need the elixirs or the ethers, but I will be getting the elixirs just in case. That same here, I actually can barely skip the elixirs, but it's risky, so I'll probably just be getting those. <laughs> There's ethers and elixirs, and I get them both because Croc sucks. Yeah, cool also. Too, so. Yeah. Yes. Don't worry about it. We'll need yeah. them for uh, Fire Blast since you only have five power Wait, hey, no. And the rest of these guys oh, are going to try move? to catch what this What are you type talking about? That it's holding. Uh, I'm we not don't, going we've... to catch it, mainly because it would mess up the XP too much, and we're going to be using the XP share on Espeon instead of the uh, Spire. Yeah, shadows hold items, and this shadow holds an item that I want because it's a twisted spoon. Except that uh, it's impossible to catch because they gave it a really low, they gave it a zero percent catch rate for fun. Except it's the exact same as the secondary. I love so where Rysikin's feet is stuck on just meta type taking damage. Good. Yeah, you can That's feel free to just leave it at that. <laughs> you don't have to fix that. Just leave it alone. Just. <laughs> yeah, it's the only thing that. you need to see. The problem with Metatite is it actually does damage. Oh yeah. Um, unlike or it most can miss things. high jump kick. Yeah, but it usually we doesn't. Don't that. Yeah. I've never seen that personally. <laughs> I have a couple times. Oh, I've today. died to high jump kick crits so many times. Yeah, it's awful. Oh no, it's using it. <laughs> hit Espeon. Hit Espeon. Okay, hit Espeon. We're fine. This is fine. If it hits Quill, it does so much damage. It's actually <laughs> incredible. <laughs> Thankfully, Croconaw's only good stat is defense, so it's not that big of a deal. But yeah, it's like what? A, it's like a 1 in 3 to catch Medi at full health around there. I, 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 I should have it up. It's like 30 ish. I feel like it's 40 ish. Yeah, it's around there. It's the same as the starter. I think it's, yeah, 43 ish. I yeah, hate the gun. Yeah, 40. Which is obviously, which is obviously 0 for all of us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because I hate Dokken's Goldeen so much. Did anyone first ball any pokes? I haven't. Uh, I did paid. with Bailey. I first ball Quilava. Cheater. Okay. The right, double so use dig out of just to waste even more of my time. Six so far? So that's about expected, I guess. I don't throw balls for a long time, so. <laughs> and his, his balls oh, uh, work, right. work all the time, so he's at an advantage to say. Yeah, I will be getting those same balls. Oh yeah, I forgot you do too. Uh, yeah, it's fine. We'll, we'll explain it later. But yeah, the, this area is annoying because the two shadows in this area do, or two of the shadows in this area do a lot of damage because the Dunsparce is, can hurt pretty hard just because it has stab takedown. I'm taking that big optional trainer dodge. <laughs> I was holding a little oh, yeah. too much down than usual. I just I just hold straight right. You guys, come on. I mean, you lose no time to go down right, so it's fine. Yeah, but it's cooler if you don't. <laughs> oh yeah, you want to oh. do? You want to talk about cool? Skip the trainer lab. No, that's not cool. That's just dumb. Come on. It's, it's dumb because I can't do it. It's so, yeah. cool if Everyone I can. Everyone who do just it. got the twisted spoon will be giving it to them. Uh, Zeke might yeah, also take a pit forget. stop and give them an ether. <laughs> yeah, oops, don't uh, don't mention that. <laughs> I'm used to running Kulava, and uh, Kulava's menu <laughs> has a lot fewer items than Crocs does, because you sell a bunch of items. So I'm just not used to my yeah. item positioning. <laughs> it's fine. Just toss the ethers, that, that'll solve your problems. No, I, I need that, I need that. I can't get rid of that. <laughs> I, need, I need all of my PP restore items. Literally all of them. Yeah, this is uh so Juan so Juan's getting the Metatite right now and Ava is about to do that as well. Yeah, I did not get the YOLO ball. You got calm I got, the, so you're fine. I got the YOLO ball in practice. Unbelievable you got calm mind. I knew you were cheating. Try <laughs> my best. So yeah. Juan no longer needs the great ball, so he's not gonna dupe it in this case. I'm gonna get a better ball in, at, later on in the run. Yes. 
Raskin, you, you skipped the heal machine, right? I did, I just used a paralyzed heal. Yeah, uh, I can't do that because I take a million damage because my pokes suck. It's fine. I also want Croc to have as high health as possible because it's weak too much of attacks coming up. Oh. <laughs> yeah, there's a good chance my Bayleaf actually dies next fight. I got crit by Peck and it did half my health. And since I'm in hyper mode, I can't, I can't do it senses! It oh my god! <laughs> no way. No way. Yes. Bayleaf! No! Wait, what just happened? No, what? No, oh my god! It happened again. It happened! You know what? It heard me saying that I can't heal it because it's in hyper mode, and guess what? Now I can heal it! Woo! You go! Congratulations. Take those! Shoot, what do I do now? Uh. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what moves does Bayleaf have other than Shadow Rush? It's got Body uh, Slam body and Razor slam. Right now. Body Slam is Shadow Rush, except it doesn't crit, and it paralyzes things, so it's really slow. Uh, you paralyze the dunce sparse and everything is fine. I, I don't know. Nah, um, I don't know about that one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank okay. god I, I caught Meditite. That's all I cared about. The Meditite did like 2,000 damage on my Aspion. Well, shoot. Now I'm just going to lose time. Dude, it, it did that because you cheated on the Meditite getting caught mine. I didn't get YOLO Ball. If I would have got both YOLO Balls, then maybe. Well, if you got YOLO Ball, it would have just been unrealistic. You would have known you were cheating. Trip? Speaking of cheating, Juan was a world record holder for one day. Congratulations. Yeah. Pearl. It was with Bayleaf too, it was insane. Yeah. Shoutouts to uh... That day, uh, April 1st? Yeah, yeah, that one day. Yeah, it was just a coincidence. It was just weird, I, I don't know. Like, he, I think he got the run the day before and he just didn't upload it until the first. Really, really skillful. I don't know. Like, I'm still trying to figure out how he did it. We all didn't want to do that run, so we just have no just... idea what kind of luck or strats he was using. Just I don't, really I don't remember the run. So, <laughs> I don't like sorry. This chat he's, he's like a really good router. He like came up with his own route in like one or two days. Like, like he's really good at that stuff. That was really great. Bayleaf number two on the poll because that's where one is on the layout. Oh, I'd I would for Bayleaf number three. That... But then that would be Zeke. You want man. Croc to win? Do you not know how this works? <laughs> oh, I got hyper mode again! It's a 5% <laughs> with no shadow you, bar. I knew you were cheating. Wait, Unbelievable. how? It is literally 5% when it's got no shadow bar. Dude, <laughs> this happened in practice. It would come to its senses and then immediately get hyper mode. You're such a so, salsa for me, cheater. by the way. <laughs> oh, shoot. Jordan, that's your cue. Dude, my health is low. I, I don't want to go back and heal. <laughs> Alright, everyone quiet for the salsa. I want to explain what happens during the fights, go for it. I'm just gonna stay quiet and quiet the salsa. Just try not to get flinched, that's basically it. <laughs> and if you happen to have a water type with low special defense, uh, try not to get razor leafed. You know, theoretically. Random AI, these moves don't exist. I don't know what they're all talking about. No, they're they're gonna use water gun every Indeed. turn. Indeed. That's not a good sign for Ava. <laughs> I'm still surprised I got a uh, 126 in this marathon. I mean, it was it was just bound to happen, but this is six times. Oh, yeah. In like no, a week. Mir Mirby's really funny because his two starring Ludicolas are random. And the fight's slightly different depending on which ones he sends out. Yeah, they all have different moves. Uh, two of them have Rain Dance. I love have rain dance, and Airbnb's AI loves doing rain dance, and then from there, yeah, the selects moves. Yeah, the the funny thing about I mentioned there's a 15 and 16 on one of them. Uh, the funny thing about that Ludicolo is it doesn't even have the mercy to kill you if you miss the range. It uses Leech Seed, which is the slowest animation on the planet because it happens at the end of every turn, and it shows both pokes on each end of the animation, so it just takes forever. It's quite funny when you get that. No, I disagree. <laughs> I get it to my PP in this game, I believe. Uh oh, it, it loses lost. like 15 Wait, years. No way. It's <laughs> yeah. the worst. It's so bad. It's also a worse range for Rise and, or, and yes, no snacks, actually. Is. Never mind. 
I boosted plus four, so these guys are no longer ranges. He meant to hit the 29 there and dropped an input. Nicola was gonna go into dive. Which is what was gonna be faster to see. I think this is the only place in the run you'll see using two X items on one turn like that. Uh, you'll see it a couple times. I think that's... Oh, okay. Do you do that? I don't actually know. Uh, I do it, I think, in two or three fights. Nice. Depending on some leads, you might also do it, since you can't really kill anything turn one. Actually, you do do it on uh, on the last two fights. Oh, yeah. Well, like, now that Juan those mentioned aren't real. it. Those aren't actual fights, they don't count. Okay, fine, fine, what? fine. <laughs> one of them has a really epic song, and... Dude, we're, we're actually gonna have, not. like, we're having, like, a karaoke session, we're all gonna sing along to it. <laughs> <laughs> Chat, Randall will it. lead. But... It's so good. It's so good. It, it's definitely the best song in the game. I was I was meaning to say this in chat earlier in the marathon, but if we could get Cat Jam enabled for that one fight, that'd be amazing. I'm using Astonish. I hate uh, this. Are you getting flinched? I'm not. I haven't been flinched yet, but you just Astonish the first two turns. I don't want him to. I need to stop. So Astonish is like, like, you have a 30% chance of getting flinched. I think it's 30? I don't actually know. Yeah, it is. It doesn't do any damage, but if it flinches you... Well, if it flinches Espeon, it loses like a million years. If it flinches Croc, it only loses a little bit for me. But it's still pretty Flinch, bad if it happens. Well, it's just what... Don't die yeah. afterwards. Kulaba doesn't really do anything in this fight other than dig and avoid the moves. And pump X special Dude, into... Dude, used it again! <laughs> he used to have croc. This is fine. This is fine. Stop doing that. I guess it's better than critting Razor Leaf. I'm, I'm, I'm just rambling because I'm panicking. <laughs> <laughs> so you can't Honest go very opinion. off the rails. <laughs> Dude, if, if croc dies somehow, I'm screwed. <laughs> if Quill dies, I'm also in a rough I mean, spot. You can Give use Meditite if you. Yeah, yeah, but then I'd have to. But Meditite's so slow if it's not in hyper mode. And also the, the XP. Just, like, just get you, hyper mode. If it happens to have like a good hyper mode nature, which you can't tell by looking at it, then yeah, it is good. All right, salsa's over for me. All right, All right. so that means who's? I only have. I only have All right, let's two. go to Ava. Yeah. Ava or one? Oh. I'm just entering Maribi now. Yeah. And I just I killed the Sudoku. Fuck. We did it. We're at plus a Salsa oh, yeah. round two. I, I do three, believe. Actually, three. I oh, believe we I all. Don't we all equip EXP share at a different time? We're about to get an EXP share. Uh, and me and Ryzikin will equip it right away. Same time. Okay. Yeah. We're all gonna. Very equip important. It on I'm gonna forget. To, I'm gonna forget to equip it. Let's I'll go. I'll remind you. Ava, I, I I know where you're supposed to. We're gonna. I, I also know where I'm supposed to. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm not gonna miss it. I can I can backseat. 31 lead, okay, funny. Okay, I also have 31. I think yeah. everyone's had 31. I have 49 Which I, I think, think is the, the best. I think was the only one to not get 31. <laughs> Good. No, I'm, at, I'm cheating now. Let's go. Yeah, I have 31, 30. What the heck? Oh, At least neither of them have switched, but yeah, I don't know. Okay, wait, I don't actually know this. I know just I know at least one of them has died, but they like never use it. But this is 30, right? 31. Oh. It's part of the I guess that's Hungry that's strat actually is to taunt it, so it can't right, use leech right. seed. And then it'll yeah, but... be forced to use dive. Woo! Okay, I got past the 31. No, no range. I got it as well. Range doesn't exist, it can't hurt you. Hit every range. The range hurts you. Yeah, heading on to Agate for a big shot trip. I, uh, I don't know Actually, I wait. Shot I don't shot her. Hold on a second. Everyone has three shopping trips then. There's one in. Yeah, we have like a lot. There's a lot of shopping. Yeah. Yeah, we do a lot of shopping. There's like a cut. Yeah. Well, Kolava can well, technically do it too. Here. We need a lot of healing items in the game. It doesn't do a lot until much, much later. 
And even then, it's only like a couple hypers, one core store, and some revives. Yeah, it's honestly not yeah. that many. <laughs> revives are in the middle of nowhere, so you just don't grab them. Just don't you, die, forehead. You can, uh -huh. like, you get a free TM, so if you need an extra revive, just sell the TM and buy a revive. But not dying is faster. <laughs> But not for this round. <laughs> okay, that's true. Wait, spoiler, unbelievable. I can't yeah, believe we, you're spoiling. Like, we just I already had one death in this round. Wands going faster than all of us. <laughs> true. Yeah, so we got a level 13 puzzle for free, and then uh, even though puzzle is level 13, it's like arguably the most important token this entire run in different ways for all of us. Uh, yeah, we I'm actually really afraid, ma uh... we main switched to plus <laughs> Basically, two of us will be using plus for like how many fights? Like five or six fights? You need to switch to plus No. Oh yeah, definitely. So plus is uh for those of you who don't already know this, plus is a bad Pokemon. But the thing is. Not so much on my round. Yeah, you don't have much of a use for it because you actually have a good poke. Oh. Once we get to the late game, or pretty much the second half, the trainers will start using their most damaging move on the most damaged target possible. So a lot of what you can do, especially for the final fights, is have plus a lot of room to kind of be a magnet for some of the bad attacks. Allow Espeon to have some free setup. Yep. I also use it to force earthquakes because the last fights actually prefer super effective in a lot of cases. They don't like to protect their own pokes. So having oh. earthquake damage is often nice. We're done with salsa. Alright. And the revolts of the pole are in, by the way. Fayley <laughs> is the winner at 30%, 36% of the vote. Incredible. Let's go. Wow. Unfortunate <laughs> for everybody else. Oh, look at that frozen oh, feel face I'm back. on Ryzen's stream. It's so sad. Dude, it's so my internet, sad. Like, my internet like it cut out for like a little bit. Sorry, that's a hundred percent on my. It's just gonna be a montage of funny paint animations. Dude, you should actually make that at the end of this run. <laughs> really stupid, like frozen freeze frames from you, Zeke. I think maybe even Juan. I'm I don't sure. think I've had any hey, freeze frames as far as I'm aware. I don't believe you Rise, have yet. I, I, it's I need my someone turn to let next. me know when you You're doing montages. I actually saw some pretty good ones during uh, the Sword and Shield run as well. <laughs> kind of where I started to notice them. Oh. Raz, can I need, I need to know when you start the Pikachu fight so I can complain about it. Ah. Do. Okay. <laughs> and just finished Shroomish Guy. Yo, the, uh, maybe maybe Pikachu can be a beast. It's got four tries. Oh, gosh. It's mode. Uh, mention it when it happens. When it's relevant. Pikachu's like, gonna go week, awesome or... mode, I believe. Dude, two weeks ago, Pikachu almost went sicko mode for me. I was, like, asking about it. Or kind of asking apparently about it. Apparently it hasn't happened to anyone else. It's only me, apparently. I, I thought somebody else had seen it. I thought Shun's had seen it what? before. Sicko mode. Yeah. Yeah. You know. Oh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, we'll explain what it is uh, later. Probably after it can happen for anybody because we don't no, really want to see it happen. I'm complaining about it as soon as I get the chance. I'll, I'll give my play-by-play -play of the Pikachu fight as soon as I see one. Yeah, just let me know when Raz can starts the fight. Yeah. Probably Raz, right? Yeah. I don't know where you are, by the way, Zeke. You're, uh... uh am I just, I don't know. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, Rise, yeah, Rise is also frozen. Alright. They're splicing their runs, cheaters. I... Yeah. How dare you have bad internet? What the heck? <laughs> my, my stuff's back up now. It should, it should be good soon. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. So, uh, Alright. 
Well, no, not, not that. I, have not I just meant because my, my internet cut out for like 30 seconds. It's it, it. My mobile hotspot is back up. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. I thought, I, I did we talk were... about... Did we talk about Zeke playing on mobile hotspot right we don't, now? We don't, need to, we don't need to talk about it. <laughs> so, Zeke's ISP is supposed to be up right now. It's, uh... Yeah, supposed it's to be been up down for, the last for like 14 hours, basically. Like seven hours. And it, uh... It isn't right now, but, uh... So... <laughs> It's fine. From all your uh, IRL RNG luck, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> and the, gr the great thing is when Zeke's screen is frozen, we don't get to see Croc, so win win. I haven't even started well, using Surf yet. Come on, on man. Croc. Dude, that would be the worst if it freezes during Surf <laughs> oh, no. You'd have to watch <laughs> Surf forever. <laughs> Alright, Pika fight is beginning. Okay, so all the funny right, thing about is Pikachu. It is the the hit on top. It has intimidate, which lowers Pikachu's attack, and Pikachu's only move is quick attack because the devs thought it would be really funny if it only could use quick attack. So the fight is mega rigged against Pikachu because uh, the hit on top has a bright powder, so Pikachu Boy. can just miss. And uh, hit on top kills Pikachu in two hits, but Pikachu has static, <laughs> so uh, hit on top can just get paralyzed turn one and then never Fred attack again in its life. Wait, what? Oh, I, that's I you. such a killjoy. Okay, you're cheating. Dude, we're all wow, cheating. Static cheating. That's, you got the task? Almost task. Almost, just no miss turn one. So yeah, uh... So are I'm, you gonna... No, yeah. Go ahead. Oh, wow, it's, you need to crit the hit on top. It's happened to me once, where Pikachu has beat the hit on top. Nothing changes. <laughs> it's it's just a huge waste of time because it costs like 90 seconds. It's a, just oh, ridiculous. Never had Pikachu win, but I had Pikachu tie. Yeah, um, hit on top killed Pikachu. it and itself, and it's yeah. the same outcome. It loses. Yeah, even if even if Pikachu wins, it doesn't actually. Dude, hit on top is paralyzed and can't move. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, it's time! It's time! It's but Pika's not getting any crits, dude. Oh, fully paralyzed. Okay. All right. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We did it. We did it. Hey. Right, Lost so this... turns, and you didn't even come close to winning. Come <laughs> this on. This fight. This fight's pretty easy for me and Ryzekin. It's tougher for the uh, Colombero. I don't. I think yeah. it's fine for Bayleaf. I'll just get Thanks. the good lead. Yeah. I'll, I'll just get why not um, Geoded lead. Don't worry. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the, the fine thing about why not first? is that. Oh, it's fine, you go ahead. This is the first, I think, fight where you get fully random leads. And some of the leads are very not good, and some of them are very useless. And why not? Only has air coat and nut. Yeah, Power there flex, are two. Uh, whatever yeah. it is, counter. There are two ideal leads on Quell uh, it's Clan Pearl or Geodude paired with Why Not. And uh, the reason it's good is because why not does nothing, so you can just set up free and Geodude and Clamp will both die to plus one uh, confusion. So yep. it lets you set up for free and uh, well, almost guarantees a good fight. The Hitman top is technically a range of plus two, but yeah. Is anybody gonna go for? No, for any... please no. no. Okay. <laughs> there, there's a plus one range on the Hitmon top, but you never hit it, so it's not actually a range. I think that's how that works. Yeah, that range is fake. That wasn't even what I had in mind, but okay. Oh, I'm sorry, yeah. what, you, what were you thinking? Uh, anyone have any mirror code setups? Uh, the only one that could is Ava, and I don't think so. Uh, we, we kind of do. And mirror um, code, code will not work on a dark type, and I only yeah. have not with bite with Umbreon. <laughs> Umbreon Wait, is oh yeah, you have that. Fight. Okay, that's... Yeah. The so interesting yeah. thing with Miracle is it only reflects the last damage it does. So if you use Razor Leaf, hit it with a strong move first, and then hit it with Razor Leaf and do nothing. Uh, Miracle is still pretty weak. But you'll be seeing that. Yeah, that's, right. a, that's not a good one. I'm excited for that. Yeah, if, there's like a weird strat where you take the charcoal off of Quill and get a mirror coat from Flame Wheel, but it's really <laughs> risky and I don't think anyone really does it anymore. I didn't even know that was a thing, so... Oh, sorry. That That's pretty old school. Yeah, that's, uh... Yeah. Definitely pretty it, old school. I've, I've heard, but I've seen you do it, like, once, I think. Maybe. I, I like to do it just because I like uh, losing runs a lot. Losing <sighs> runs is pretty funny. Hey, the earlier you lose the run, the earlier you can do another one. Yeah, well, that's yeah. It's like I always say, uh, 
kill your run is just a, another chance to watch the intro. Who doesn't like watching the intro for six hours? Yeah, so it's just go filming it for a while. Yep. Early game can be a tough one, and you can be stuck in the early game for a long time. Uh, we're kind of bypassing a lot of it by just, for one, having a backup save, and two, just taking whatever. But, yeah, the MIP's hard to hit, and also you also then need to get a good secondary if you're not running uh, Umbreon. But running Umbreon is, a, is its own problem, because manipping two Pokémon is harder than manipping one, as it turns out. It's shocking how that works. <laughs> Alright. Play by play coming up on the Pikachu fights from Ava and Juan. Scrub oh, yeah. has sent in his hit on top. The only reason uh, we mentioned Mirror Code is because uh, all of us except Ryze can want to have low health on our secondary so we can get uh, Torrent Blaze or Overgrow for Mount Battle so that we can actually one hit KO things because uh, even though Croc is a water type, it doesn't one hit KO anything if it doesn't have Torrent. You mean. Water Blaze and Grass Blaze? I got the Pika crit, but no paralysis. It doesn't touch uh, that health. I had the Ryzen fight. You know how your purification That's ceremonies great. go, guys? Yeah. Right. Ryzen's just gonna like, also, save a million uh, years on me. Also, is checking his email, uh, as you would always do in a speedrun. Yep. If you check your email fast enough, it doesn't even register, but I've never had it personally. Uh, yeah, I've, I've had it happen when I like first started running. I just leave it the screen open for like the quarter second. Got a good lead, I, let's go. I and Rise is gone. Lead. Oh gosh. But I'm level 35, so I'll go for the plus one and prove it, it, it exists. I, no, it's not, gonna, it's it not worth exist. it. It's not it's worth gonna it. It's gonna exist. It's not, we'll just watch me. I've, I've only hit it once in my life. Alright, will, will one cheat or will he not? Let's find out. I almost targeted Why Not with Confusion. That would have been funny. Also, no, I, Zeke I'm is the sure. first one to do the Relic Stone Detour. Uh, Ryzen obviously doesn't need to do that because he doesn't have a Shadow Pokemon to purify. Everyone else yeah, will. My fish ate the Hitmon top, and now it's going to become big. I didn't become, get the range. It's going to become fish. big fish. Yep. Mega fish. Bayleaf is getting kicked from triple, triple kicks. Oh, okay. Crit down to 10. Is my screen That's... still frozen? Because I want to make a point of doing something real quick. Oh, you're good. You're good. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. I want, I want all of you guys to pay attention to my menuing in like 20 seconds. Alright. Is this 1 gaming? Oh, absolutely. Oh, let's go. I'm also going to do 1 gaming. Guys, guys, check this out. This is optimal gameplay. What is going on? <laughs> Boom. It saves time, trust me. Don't listen to Juan, he's a liar. Did you just switch the move? Oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna swap play move with slot mine just for fun. Bastard. Why? Yeah, I do it, well, I do it to look, time. Once I finish writing the tasks, and I'll let you know which one's actually faster. Juan doesn't believe that that's faster. Unbelievable. Look, if someone's the authority on what is faster in Colosseum? Come on. I actually never swap flame moves from slot one, but I'm gonna do it for this round. I don't even know how to swap moves in this game. I don't really I don't really have any muscle memory currently anyways, <laughs> so I might as well. Yeah, I say that, on, move. I say that on a move. I say that on a move. And now I have two I've... psychic moves, and my stronger one is not in slot one. I have to consciously remember to click right. down if I ever want to use Psybeam. Hopefully, can fix a lot of things here. He'll get a better psychic move in slot one later. Yes, yeah, so we don't have to do it for the whole rest of the run. It is really funny because two psychic moves is like he's playing XD. The current XD, XD round. is XD psychic move. is such a meme. No, meme? I think it's good. It's real. It's, it, it's, it's real, it's faster, and it's good. Okay, me and Zeke were yes, me yes, and Zeke yes. were believers since day one, yeah. yeah, yeah well recognize that, so it's clearly the fastest. That's just how it works. That's how that works. Yeah. That's the truth. Yeah. 
So, yes. hidden power, depending on your stats, they can be any type you want. In Kolo, we want it to actually be like a coverage move for, for the team of Espeon and whatever. You don't need coverage uh, in XC. In XC, you don't really need that, yeah. So, they use hidden power psychic. <laughs> That's good. It's good. It's stronger than uh, Psybeam, so, okay. And you get it doesn't... way earlier, right? Yes, absolutely. Yeah. In XD, you can't actually... I don't think you can ball dupe, and you definitely can't do the x no. glitch. But they have their own uh, workarounds to that. Hidden Power to Psychic? The Hidden Power Psychic and Agate? Uh, no, a secondary, in that doesn't suck. Hidden Power Psychic in Fennec uh, for in XD is so nice. Yeah. They get the sub two hour snaddle times for sure. Yeah. I don't think that's really real. Good. What? It's. It's definitely real. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait, I'm about to get Psybeam. I'm about to almost catch up to the guy who's going way faster than me. Except not really. See, Surf one hit KO stuff, but it doesn't even matter because it's the world's slowest move. Yeah. With Blaze, Flame Wheel is just faster. And then, I don't know what Relief looks like, but I'd imagine it looks pretty slow too. Oh, Surf really does awful. clear these fights a lot faster than my route. I have to rely on Flinch Luck or Crits to go oh, fast. Gosh. And That's just got Mag yeah. 10, so I think Espeon's gonna die. Oh no. <laughs> Ooh. That's a uh, not great side. Can Mag 10 kill Umbreon as well, or and just like wipe you? Not or... HP, thankfully. Okay. Oh, Espeon lived on two. Let's go. I forgot to mention the funny part of this game where Is that uh, plays? <laughs> Pokemon get sent into the fight mid turn if you knock something out, which means that you can just one one turn these fights with three pokes, which is funny. I almost cancelled- I almost cancelled Colavis Evolution, I had no. a heart attack. <laughs> oh my gosh, Ava. Is that in one of my practice runs? I've never done that in my life. I didn't I it doesn't really longer. matter. No, uh, no. It's... With Colava, yeah. If you get Evolution fast enough, like, who cares? Yeah, I think Colava's the only one that could potentially not evolve on Purification, but that's- yeah, I think you'd have to be pretty unlucky for that to happen. I can also not evolve on purification if I miss out on an FXP. It's, it's yeah. yeah. If you don't get lava, anything it's pretty in close. Colosseum, like yeah, you're just like one fight away from evolving if you is, get Is Meganium at 32? Meganium's at 32, right? Yeah. Yeah. Meganium will always at, evolve. Croc is. at 30. And then Typhlosion's at 36. Needs to get nerfed somehow. It's nerfed by me playing. <laughs> oh, oh. But, but it is, it is okay that... if Quilava doesn't evolve, because uh, you'll level up in the first few fights in that battle, which is fine as yeah. level up. If, if you miss level 36, you'll barely miss it, so you'll level up right away. Unless you die. Um, the first few fights for Quilava, honestly fine, but Magnitude get the does ranges. exist. But I'm not going to get Magnitude, so it's fine. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Rizekin already took the Mag 10 for all y'all. Exactly. Thank him for that. I've never seen Magnitude in never this will. area of rock because uh, they're not allowed to use that. You just water them. Oh yeah. Uh, Zeke, I don't know if you did it yet, but I feel like we're, we'll probably see Ava do it now. It's a funny thing where you can tire... When you can... Uh, I did do allies. it, I did do it. Okay, you did do it. I, I was gonna say, I should have mentioned it when I was doing it. I yeah. will be doing it turn two of my fight. Doing what? Attacking uh, your, your secondary. To um, knock yeah. it into blaze or grass blades. You have a high chance of critting grass a Pokemon. Blaze. Grass yeah, blaze. Yeah, uh, a lot of people Still don't overgrow. know. Grass blaze it. They, they added like a really funny feature into this game. It's only in this game where uh, if Espeon's attacking one of its allies, actually it's a 50% crit rate. Dude, actually. I would say 100, but... Well, so, uh... Matter. But yeah, this is uh so now we're in we're starting the don't crit your ally challenge uh impossible. Watch me hit my ally here. I've probably confused my ally more than I've critted. <laughs> I'm gonna what? crit, watch. 
Ow. I've definitely, uh-huh. I've definitely confused a couple for alligators in my day. I, I confused my Typhlosion. Thank you for cursing me. Uh, you want to talk about curses? I forgot to revive my Bayleaf that had died. So what? It's me currently. <laughs> I'm fighting with Umbreon. Uh, it's fine. Uh, it's fine. It's it really like... doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Is that is that cheating using a faster route? Yes, I'm switching mid mid run. I luckily didn't hit myself in confusion, so I'm fine. <laughs> Yeah, hitting your allies, uh, it's faster if it goes well. If it, uh, doesn't go well, uh, 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 things happen. Yeah, pretty much all the AI, all, or most of the AI in this area is, like, totally random, so it's really hard to, like, reliably put yourself into blaze or grass blaze. Yeah, early on. Eventually, so you, there's actual AI, but... Yeah, you just we, do it yourself. Are you we just calling it grass blaze now? I am. Well, I'm calling it Water Blaze too. What? I don't know. What is it called? Uh, Overgrow. Uh, Overglow. I don't know. <laughs> Overgrow. Overglow. <laughs> we can call so, it Overglow. You're like glowing because you have low health. It's like really shiny. <laughs> Sorry, I've never used the Bailey before. I have, unfortunately. I have two. I lied. Sorry. <laughs> Damn, lies and deceit. It's a trap. Uh, wait, I'm about to fight the only poke that Typhlosion is the only one that can kill. Because the, for some reason there's a little leap here and it's really hard to KO. Oh gosh. It's a it's a, it's a Surf plus Psybeam range for me, but I got a good combo here. So uh, I'll actually be guaranteed. Uh, if it leads uh, and it survives, it uses Sandstorm and wastes a million years. Alright, well my Umbreon shenanigans are, are done now. Good. No Did cheating in fast Yes. Can you imagine right. if I just like grabbed a Typhlosion really quick for a few fights? Yeah. Just put it, grab it at full HP, so you have to actually like set up plays. I wish I could watch surf animations right now. <laughs> so I'll be hitting like, my, one. I'll be hitting my Meganium into Blaze, hopefully. Leaf Blaze or Leaf yeah. Blaze? Is that what we're calling? Leaf it? Blaze. <laughs> sure. Yeah. We should all just have different versions of the same thing. Yeah, I'll I, say, uh, I'll, I, I call Grass Blaze. Mine is Fish Blaze. Badger fish blaze. blaze. Yeah, because it's Blaze, but like, for the fish. <laughs> Alright. I missed a trap. If I'm like, range. rambling. I got to see oh, some wait. Sandstorm animation. I'm ahead? No way. See, Surf is good. This is why people thought Surf was good, because it's faster for this one segment. Look, there's a famous quote in our server. Uh, <laughs> some people like to go fast, the others like to use Surf. Oof. I'm not like the other girls. <laughs> oh yeah, my type potion. If, I, if my type potion had a little bit more experience, I believe uh, it would be fast enough to speed time my Espeon here. Oh no, oh yeah, you're hasty, I forgot. Yeah. <laughs> it, it changes some of the fights if your Typhlosion is plus speed, because then it could potentially yeah. outspeed Espeon. I don't like think Ganyum that's going to be the case successfully acquired here, Grass Blaze. However, in practice Indeed. it was the case. Anyway, oh. here's, here's another uh, lesson in how Croc can't kill anything. I, huh. it, it just it just can't. One fight with no ground types and Frogators just becomes useless instantly. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing how that works. Except that's actually good because it puts me into a lower torrent, so I won't level up out of torrent later, which is good. It also sets up my HP for something later, which is a little complicated. But I'll get oh, into gosh. it eventually. Yeah, the final yeah. boss in this area is annoying as hell, especially with Croc. I guess I should start calling it fine. <laughs> It's actually really easy with Koaba. Yeah, it's, I don't it's... think I've ever wiped it a game. It's a little straightforward. Well, okay, it's... speak for yourself on that one, Ava. Definitely wiped. It's more straightforward with the the green fish and the black fish, but uh, it's a little bit odd because there's a weird HP manipulation I have to do for it. Yeah, uh, so 
So we haven't really talked a lot about the plot. I don't know how much of the plot any of us actually knows, but yeah, well, that's we don't actually know the plot. We, we're just there's, gonna ignore it. There's like a there's like a couple of villainous teams. We've met Team Snagum and Team Cipher, I believe. Uh, team Snagum, uh, as their name implies, they snag them. They snag Pokemon. Uh, no way. Team Cipher, uh, they're they're doing stuff. It's a little unclear what they're doing right now, but they're doing stuff, and wow. I think they've taken over Mount Battle, so we need a free Mount Battle or something like that. So they basically learned that Celebi is kind of the key to purifying Pokemon, and they're trying to get the Time Flute from uh, uh, Leader Vanda? Why do you remember yeah, this Vander. game? What's How wrong you, with you? What? <laughs> I read the text box. They're so slow in English. You don't read them. That is true. That is true. <laughs> That's true. You can't not read the I don't text. Know. Of this game. I kind of, I kind of like fall asleep. In between I'm too busy things. watching all the surf animations to read the text. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're frozen on. on a surf animation. Dude, um, let's oh, go. No. We did it. I don't know. When I'm watching animation, I take time to, you know, think about more beautiful things in life. I look out my window. Yeah, I think about how much faster this room would be if I had a fire fish instead. See? Cool off as a fish, guys. Sorry, I did what? Did I say that out loud? Nope. Which is <laughs> just the normal surf animations. My HP is uh, so stupid. Jordan. Are you gonna Are level you up? No, but uh, my HP and uh -oh. like defense stat is like, oh my god, word for the trepench. Um. Potion. Just win. Smiley face. I need I need a high roll, I think. Cause I I have to hyper and I need a high roll. Unless I get barboat slate, I can just get barboat slate. Oh my god, wait a minute. Dude, the most amazing thing ever is about to happen for me. Surf uh, is gonna hit only one target and yo, then it's gonna do it's gonna do he's, full damage. It's gonna be a barboat slate of my life. I actually got it. <laughs> I never see it. Barboach lead have I all always see Barboach lead, yeah. <laughs> so Talia, the one that Ava's fighting right now, she always sends out uh, Trapinch, but her partner that she sends out as her lead can be uh, a I lead or Barboach that we see on, on her screen right now. Barboach is infinitely better, at least on this round. This is a reminder yeah. for XP share for those who it applies to. Not yet. The XP share. Okay, wait. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ramble for a bit. Feel free to stop me, but I'm just gonna talk oh, about go. my, uh, my stop, deck team stop, play. Stop. Okay. <laughs> just kidding. Go. I need, I need a very specific uh, health on Fralligator for this, for the final fight in this area because I need to. He leads with a Matang, and I need to be out of death range on both of Matang's moves, but I need to. It has Earthquake and Psychic as its main moves that I'm worried about. Um. I need to be both of them, but I have to be low enough health that getting hit by one Earthquake puts me in kill range for one Psychic. So what? it's like weird and specific. Because if if I don't get put into kill range for Psychic on turn two, uh, it will like protect and waste a million turns and it sucks. Here's the first instances where I'm using an X special on Bayleaf. Mm, don't, what? don't see those very often. <laughs> Yeah, so sometimes uh, we're going to be using our X specials on our our secondaries. I think everyone oh, yeah. has that at some point. I have that on the Dakim fight, yeah. I don't think but, I uh, that's D. Not very common. Uh, there are some combos, I think, of... Wait, oh, wait, right? Uh, actually, Ryzekin will do it in fight 8. Oh. Oh, right, yeah, eight, yeah. Eight. Which one's that? Yeah, there's a Duskull the and Duskull, Krill, yeah. Yep. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. So yeah, uh, let's see. Also, at this point, our fights are now going to have some sort of smart AI for the rest of the run. I think everyone's past the point where the real battles start here, or whatever it is. Yeah, we, we were making fun of me for collecting ethers earlier. Well, it turns out I already need to use one. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, the, 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 the problem with using surf hey. all the time is that you need oh to get gosh. more surfs. Good thing we got some ethers. That's sad. <laughs> and I got to potion fish. See? Who might think to slot one even makes the ether menu faster? You guys are ridiculous. 
<laughs> I mean, if Ava moves Fire Blast out of slot one, then. No, you want Flame Wheel in slot one. Because I actually you don't forgot to remove Flame Wheel to slot one. Just so sad. Go. Because I'm not going to do it now. Oh, now it's, only, now it's definitely not worth it. <laughs> I'm the only one doing optimal strats. As long as, long as your muscle memory doesn't account for it. Zeke says he's using optimal strats, but he's it's using faster. croc. Not that part. <laughs> <laughs> optimal strats wheel. for croc. Flame wheel slot one is faster for, for Quilava 2. Okay, so d wait, depending on the combo I get here, okay, I didn't get it, but there's a really funny combo where I, not only do I have to X special my Fralligator, I have to also X speed it, which is really funny, but uh, you're only gonna get X special on Croc, sorry. Oh, I guess another Fight part of that. Nine here, this is the first instance where I use Plusle, and this is the only route, I think, of the four of us where we plan to see self-destruct. Uh, <laughs> oh, goodness. Just oh, not to get crit. Fight. Eva, what's your special attack? Not good enough that it's not. I, I, I Did you say if it was I 60? get level, if I get level 39, which I'm not 100% sure I'm getting, uh, I'll be. Uh, no, it's not 60. It's 58. So I could. Oh. With a, a lower end. That's of not that bad. It's, it's not bad. It's a, it's a really good range. It's like a very good range, yeah. That's good enough. Oh my All goodness, right. Espeon! No, you idiot. What happened? What happened? I got I got crit, but it doesn't matter. Fine. Prince if don't I get, lose time in this game. If I get outsped by Entei, it kills me, but that's the only problem. You never get outsped by Entei. That's huh. not. It's, I've only seen it once. I've only seen it once. To me, I've seen it. I didn't even know that was possible. <laughs> I've, yeah. I've seen it in clips, but I haven't had it it's, happen it's to me. It's a ridiculously small chance, but it's it can happen. And if it happens, my Espeon dies. But yeah, and uh, the last part of my this, my this fight that I forgot to mention is I want to be in Torrent because I use Surf a lot, but that's kind of obvious. <laughs> I will now equip the experience chair. You did it. Whoa. Okay. Rats. All right. I believe that means the experience chair has been uh, successfully equipped by everybody. Well, I have not equipped it yet, but it's coming. Oh, we'll okay. see if we all remember to remove it in time <laughs> for those of us who actually remove it. I'll, be, I'll yeah. be going for the safe strat where I keep the experiencer on for one extra fight. Just to get level 50 in okay, case so I get Flygon Clay at all lead. What, what, what leads? Wait, what? What was that? Yeah, I'm not spoiling anything. <laughs> Even though I just said it. I didn't but hear yeah. it. It's fine. Yeah, true, true. It's too hot on Zeke's screen, so it turned red. Yeah, the screen just really wanted to have a Typhlosion, so it became a Typhlosion for us. Wait, yeah, did my screen wait. freeze? No. Oh. No, Zeke's did. Oh, Zeke's screen ah. froze again. Okay. Oh. oh. I, I didn't think it's fine, right? From Legends oh, I won. I, I, I just finished the fight. Oh, but I just missed? I have some really dumb stuff that uh, I have to 95%, do. Uh, 95%, yeah. Okay, I mean, it's just 95 for individually for Ooh. each poke, so... Yeah, for each one. So, Twice the chance of missing. Yeah. Okay, so if you see me doing really funny menuing right now, uh, ignore it, and it, it'll... It, I Are you moving the, the moves back? No, unfortunately not. Um, <laughs> you see, the next fight we that I have to do is... Um, it's good for the... It, it's like a fine fight for the most routes. Uh, it's horrible for Croc, and if any one thing goes wrong, you instantly lose. Uh, so, so okay. I routed myself a backup for the fight. Which is slightly safer, but also if one thing goes wrong, you still get out. But it is slightly <laughs> safer. So uh, ignore the part that can go wrong. Ignore the part where I intentionally put Plusle on the first slot of my party. So uh, it's going to be a while before we actually watch that fight. So uh, let's all root for the people's hero Plusle to do a great job uh, in the next fight. Also ignore my weird poke machine menuing. I need my croc to be at a very specific health. <laughs> we'll talk about that later. Oh my croc, gosh. Has, croc has a Super lot of potion. weird health manipulation. It's really, really annoying. Super potion Espeon. Yeah, I can't. I can't like machine heal or anything, or like just use hypers on both my pokes. I need specific health. 
I did not That's realize that Espeon was barely out of bite range. It was out of bite range by 1 oh. HP. <laughs> so I got Torment, but it's fine. Is that fast slow or is it not fast slow? It's fine, I just used Reflect and then... Okay. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> No, no, that sounds, it was fine. Uh, it was fine. Great. I lost. I lost a turn. It's whatever. <laughs> okay, so I, I, I'm like two XP off of getting level thirty nine here. So I'm gonna I have a range. I, I believe in you. It's a I good don't. range. I trust. But I miss you. it every time. Well, no, you get more experience from the first year, dude. That's true, but I don't know if she's a camp for that. I don't know. Oh, maybe she has. Yeah. I've never missed that range in my life. Everybody's... We don't need to talk about that. I've missed it so everybody. many times. <laughs> <laughs> That's because you run bad quills, though. You get desperate. True. I think everyone's using like a, a spreadsheet to keep track of their stats and like their damage rolls because yes. Random secondaries we... mean. Wait, I'm gonna be level random 39. Random I didn't even realize. Oh, that's See, funny. Yeah, you, you're fine. You did a random good yeah. job. I didn't crit. need it. Live on one. Oh! oh. Uh, is that boys? That's the second time your Espeon lives at like zero HP. <laughs> nice. This Both is why Ryzen's only two massive moves in this run. You just, just run back and save Eva. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do it. Saving takes a while rain. in this game, and uh. Yeah, saving takes a million years. If it didn't take that long to save in this game, uh, I'd probably do a lot of that. <laughs> and you can only do it at PCs. So that was a seven. That was a seven out of eight range there. I'm buying extra. I'm buying extra healing items. I'm going loser mode. Sorry. Damn. Actually going loser mode. I don't actually I need them. I lied. I, I'm not going to. Never mind. I thought I you were gonna I, go awesome mode. I'm a winner. I'm gonna go winner mode. Sorry. Let's go. I don't need those extra hypers, I'll be fine. So, welcome to the Under. Uh, the Under is a... I don't know. It's like Australia, it's down under or something. I don't know. So it's, it's under? Yeah. So, I think the story about it is like... So... Uh, Kalu and XD are based in the Ore region. O double R E. It's based off of Arizona for some reason. I don't really know why Genus, Genus Nori wanted to do that, but well, because there's like a giant city under Arizona, that's why they needed to make it based off Arizona. <laughs> I knew Australians were equal. Let's chat. Yep. Yep. So yeah, but it's a cipher stronghold or something like that, I guess, because. Venus, yeah. the person who is on the TV, she's uh, the next Cypher admin that we're going to be fighting. Uh, that's the next fight, in fact. Uh, Zeke has set up his HP to <laughs> well, not we'll get, get to have anything go wrong. You'll see what happens later. Well, actually, there's a problem where you intentionally take one hit from one Pokemon, and except it hits both your pokes, and if it crits either of them, you instantly lose. That's the only problem with the fight. Everything else is good. I've been crit enough because I'm going into the Steelix as well here soon. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. For those, if uh, I don't, I think I forgot to mention it. The reason I put Plus on the front is because good AI will target anything that it can KO, and if it can KO both things on the field, it will KO the thing it does more damage to. So basically, everything will always target Plus all the time. It's quite useful. It's used yeah. a lot. We'll see, it a, we'll see it a lot. Yeah. But I'm, bring, I, I'm bringing it up now because it's happening in my next fight. A nice side effect of when you only use a few pokes, the other pokes stay under leveled, and that means they stay very weak. And in this game, that's actually good. XD has a workaround to make their AI less abusable, which makes the game less fun. If any of y'all <laughs> XD makes runners want to say anything about it. No, we don't talk about XD. XD's Sorry. AI is less fun. Oh, it yeah. is random. Yeah. Or, for sucks. the most part, random. random. There is some trainers that have like specific AI patterns, but it's just random. It'll <laughs> it's choose any word. moves. No matter what any trainer, person. it's random targeting, which yeah, makes it's it random fun. targeting. Yeah. Not random <laughs> move, for the most part. If you're going to play a game with 
with no AI, I might as well just play a mainline game, Kappa. Why would we do that? What? This isn't a mainline game? It's a mainline game. Okay. Jordan, no it is not. I'm, I'm it's about not to a great game. It's a mainline oh, no. game in my heart. Aww. They both Aww. are. You can trade Tech. with the mainline Brown. games, which Come makes on. it a mainline game. I, I agree, oh, yeah. it's a mainline Tech game. Terrific. This is the worst Dante of all time. That did absolutely <laughs> nothing with Fire Blast on a rash ass yeah. Okay, I'm about to go shopping, and the, sh the <laughs> yeah. shopping trip Wait, is going to look... Wait, it did. Hold on. This I'm trip is going to look slightly correctly, different. Ava... It did 60 damage. Yeah. 69 damage. Nice. Nice. Shopping trip is going to look slightly different from all of us, because uh, this guy sells TMs, and we all want slightly different TMs. So, Me my is and I... I don't know. I think, I think Ryzen, you're are you buying a TM-15, or is it just me? Oops, I forgot to I'm just protects and hidden power. So, my Espeon is Rash and 3 IV special defense, and Entice Fire Blast did 69 damage. That's nice. like absolutely nothing. <laughs> okay, so the reason. You secretly uh, have plus special defense. Oh, yeah, I'm reason, secretly sassy. The reason Crowd Gator sucks and is garbage is because the only way for it to do damage is to teach it Reem, and Hyper Reem does not have 100 accuracy. But it's close. Anyway. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's so allegedly. It won't be the only <laughs> thing learning Hyper Beam, though. Wait, you do too? No. The other one. Bailey does get Hyper Beam. Oh, does it? I thought it was the other one. I thought it was Umbreon. Yeah. I got it. Umbreon yeah. used to get Hyper Beam when you used okay. to do some Actually, fights. Stuff? Yeah. Right. It's been so long Dang. since I ran no snags. Yeah, also. A bunch of protects. We're all going to get a bunch of protects because uh, we're going to be under level for most of the game, so we need a way to kind of game the AI a little bit. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to be using a lot of protect. So I think everyone except Ava is going to teach protect a plusle. Great. Yeah. yeah. I only buy two protects. Yeah. I'm for the rest of us. I protect yeah. for all three of my pokes. I only am going to teach the one to Umbreon right now. To be on and plusle, we'll get it later. I unfortunately need it on Espeon immediately. Ooh, I messed up and healed Espeon instead of X Specialing, but I got the Entei range at plus three. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> what? Range, that range Ooh, is yeah. not bad. Sprail Entei bad. there. Yeah, my PB. Oh, I got crit. There's a free Live. box. We we have we have three free rare candies because the game devs didn't actually hate us that much. But you don't get any more. Those will be useful we... later. But we have to kind of walk into the room to pick them up. On JPN, you can like pick them up from outside the room. <laughs> yeah. Wait, we're what now? We're JPN, the, it has like an extended bot. Or like you can interact with it through the wall. You don't actually have to like enter the little <laughs> room. That's cool. okay. So Another JP to, time save. They found a way okay. to scam. Okay. They found a way to scam us. Shout out to a, Venus, by the way. Uh, just, just see. a quick, uh, yeah, just a quick. Uh, here's, here's Exhibit A on uh, why plus was useful. They will both target it while I just buff up my SB because uh, SB is good, but it can't really one hit KO anything in this fight. You need to like plus two to, or I guess you need plus one to one hit KO the bio plate, but plus two to one hit KO the other stuff. And uh, yeah. the reason I want Plusle is because if uh, she just happens to like lead Bayonet, um, then Espeon just kind of gets um, immediately owned because of no Shadow Ball, which is physical. And it completely destroys you. Yeah, yeah, so now that we're all done with Mountain Battle, this is kind of where all our routes kind of diverge. So Croc was ahead at coming out of Mountain Battle, but now it'll lose time on every split coming after. Yes, literally uh, everywhere. Will will gain time in every split after. Um, Umbreon will Bar keep its steady so pace. Well. And Bayleaf is going to be losing some time as well. Okay, this is I'm about I'm about to have the scariest turn in the entire game. Because the Steel Elix is really strong and it knows Earthquake and it's really scary and if it crits me, I die. Oh, that's nothing. Don't worry about it. You can survive EQ from that Steel Elix with a plus defense type potion if you're like pretty much max IV. <laughs> Wait, what now? You can do that? Yeah. All right. <laughs> You'd have to be like, uh, that's uh, whatever, that's ridiculous. <laughs> I think All you're right. a, like a bad range to survive. I know because I've had a tab yeah. and I was extremely surprised. Okay, and then I just so, then I just missed. So. 
So the funny thing about the Steelix and the and a uh, reason Crocs suck so bad is look, Steel it can't even two hit KO the Steelix. That's why I have low HP because this earthquake will knock me into torrent and let me two hit KO it. That that's is the reason so I have. Sad. That's the reason you manip torrent for this fight. And as you can see, it did over half to both my pokes. So if uh, it got a crit on either one of them, I would have gently uh, died and just would have been screwed. But that was uh, a perfect Venus, so I'm happy. That's good. All right. So rise against the next Venus fight. Yep, I'm starting it right now. So oh I got my, the my fight is basically Venus. just have Plusle take the hits, like was explained earlier. It comes down to just hope Steelix doesn't crit Espeon. <laughs> Espeon can survive because it's bulky. It's got high defense IV. His is a high level than mine, I believe. Uh, I'm not sure. So I'll be doing a slightly different strat where I won't actually be using Plusle. But I won't be using yeah. Bayleaf either, so. <laughs> what? He, has, a, this, uh, he has this cool skin. thing where he actually gets a fire move. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Well, so since Plusle's so low, it gains levels anytime it gets XP, <laughs> which is quite slow. Yes. So I will be opting not to use Plusle there. Yeah, and Plusle it's learns easy. moves as well. And we're going to see all of those moves that Plusle learns because Ryzekin's Plusle is going to level up a couple of times. <laughs> Wait, I totally forgot I do this. I'm gonna. I use the rep my three row candies instantly after beating Venus, which nobody Plus else will do. Plusle does its job there, making sure Espeon doesn't get the attract from Del. The Bailey Frow does use rare candies immediately after Venus. Oh, okay, cool. You do it if you uh, forget experience there and quell. Oh, you're right. So I see what Steelix does. But yeah, uh, because Croc sucks, I need my Espeon to be at as high level as possible as soon as possible, so that I can actually KO stuff. Yeah, uh, one is... Hey, we got the Earthquake under now. Oh, yeah. Zeke is heading to the stairs. Um, stairs is... Probably don't die there, but it's, uh, you can lose time. Stairs yeah. are actually pretty safe with Croc. They're actually not that bad. Okay. Croc is way better for stairs than Quilava is. Well, way safe That's... for... Oh. Slowly, everything is better than Quill. Fun fact: You would, if you uh, were paying attention, you would have seen something very different about my game compared to the other runners here when I was buying Sage. my TMs. And it's that the order of my TMs uh, actually are uh, in uh, numerical order, uh, going from oh, the... uh, oh I didn't know that. compared to MTSC, which is a neat little difference. The one difference between the games that. At least that we can notice. I don't know. If there's any yeah, it's, others. It's, it's very small, but it's just like a fun little, fun little difference. I believe In it's European makes people. How like faster by whatever amount it takes to few inputs. Yeah. To do the input. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, so how optimal? Y'all want to talk about version differences for XD? Not really. Run pal. All right. Run pal. Is Run pal. Is for young pal. If you can afford it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah. If you can't afford it, just don't run the game. That's what I do. Uh, we have emulator leaderboard, so you can somehow get an ISO for that. It's uh, it's one section of the game that I don't know if I can actually do on keyboard. XD. <laughs> oh. Avon knows exactly what I'm talking about. I think he just figured it out. Anyone, any bounce line? Uh, <laughs> we'll have to have like our key bound that only walks at 32% speed. But that's that sounds like cheating. I don't know. Yeah. If you ever but... see me using hyper mode when I do, or hyper beam when I don't need to, it's because having the turn where I do nothing is slightly faster than just like using slash and then having to select a move next turn. But yeah, oh, yeah, I, I also did. Now. I also did my item menu early. Uh, people didn't notice that. What happened to that Teddy Urso on that frozen screen? <laughs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> Add it to the montage. <laughs> it probably, it probably just got owned because it gets hyper beam. True. Yeah. 
true. Ignore the ignore the part where I had to use surf in that fight because there's a ground type for some reason. I didn't see that. <laughs> Good. I wish I didn't either. <laughs> uh, so I'm starting my stairwell fights. See what kind of combo luck I get here. It's kind of where combo luck starts to matter, and why the fights yeah. become much longer in the notes. Oh, yeah. The devs, the devs thought it would be really funny if they required me to use surf in every single fight in this area. <laughs> this one or Mount Battle? No, this area too. Everyone oh except the, the the fourth fight. So three out of the four requires a surf. So, anyways, I started blasting. It's time to start <laughs> using fire blast. Uh oh. Oh. A move gosh. that a move that can actually one hit KO stuff. It's incredible. If it hits. I will yeah, it always will hit. Worry about it. Rage. There's a, there's a lot of blast. really there's uh, a lot of really dumb spots where you miss you just get immediately owned. Yeah. This Venus is particularly bad. A couple of other places are bad, but I, I really dislike Venus. Alright, who do you think you're getting as your lead? I don't mind this lead. I got Steelix lead. It's fine. Okay, Steelix lead yeah, is so scary for me. Dude, Steelix lead for Croc is so stupid that you need to use an X special on SB and plus one Psy Beam the Steelix. Wait, <laughs> that's incredible. Psy Beam? Yeah, plus one Psy Beam plus Torrent Surf kills it. <laughs> it's really, really dumb, but it's the only way to do it. We're learning things here tonight, everybody. Gosh. Yeah. Uh, mostly learning to not run the bluefish. Yep. I agree. I'm just making sure to not miss an input here and accidentally protect twice. You know? Protecting twice? Uh, I, I, I've done that many a time. <laughs> Same. Uh, Try making sure not to do it. I, I did it once on Evis when I was two and a half minutes ahead of PB. Never Who's again. Evis? I don't know. Have we seen him yet? I don't think so. Yeah, I, don't, I haven't seen him yet. Yeah, probably not, no. Sorry for yeah. pronouncing it different than everyone else. Isn't it, Evis? Wait, y'all all say Evis? What the? I do, Evis, sorry. just do you know their name for Santa Claus or something? No, that's Deli Bird. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> fair enough. Deli Bird Plus, joins the battle. <laughs> Jordan's got the right pronunciation. He, Jordan does things right. Except for when he threatens to mute me when I speak the truth. But yeah, we don't mention I, that. He's Italian, it's Eviche. <laughs> <laughs> they hate I it. like that one. Oh my god. Wait, is that? No, it's not Blaze, right? 37 times 3? Uh, that's. Uh, 37 times 3 is that is 111. Blaze. Yeah, you're Oh, so I can just do this, right? Just. I'm Wheel? Or yeah. whatever the spray. Yeah. yeah, flame wheel kills it. If yeah. You if you have I, it I, I got a rocks. I got rock slide crit on Typhlosion into Blaze. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait. So if you thought Surf was funny, and if you thought that single target Surf was even funnier, get ready for plus one single target Surf because it's the only way to kill Shadow Pilot Swine in one hit. <laughs> <laughs> That's how. Oh, all right. I'm about to start uh, uh, Venus. But I will not Pilot be Swine using is... the muscle. Wait, what are you doing? You'll see. He doesn't All need right. to. Let's find out. Also, I won't be using Bayleaf though. No. Oh yeah, the sun's coming out over How here in Europe, and I'm being blinded. Have? Uh, we caught a shadow earlier, actually. Well, oh, can steal it tight? Yeah, the it's funny tight, thing about. Yeah. Meditite is because it's a shadow, it doesn't gain XP, so it's faster than using plus one in a lot of spots. You'll see that more, even more later in the round. Looks like you have a pretty runner. decent nature on your, your Meditite one. Oh, do I? It's a pretty decent shadow bar, right? I'm like party movement. Uh, <laughs> I did have to send it out for one mat, uh, one fight. He has the okay, naughty Meditite, I knew he was cheating. <laughs> yeah, so, so Dull Caddy here is a range, but if you don't kill it, it'll kill itself with double edge after it kills the Meditite, and so Espeon just gets a bunch of XP. Oh. 
It's a nice backup if you miss early XP. Um, He's secret routing without me one. Damn. <laughs> Hiding strats. Um, it only that actually does sound like a pretty good idea, though. Yeah. Good job. Thank you, thank you. I should have hidden the strat where you What if you just do that there? instead of holding experience share for one extra fight for Quill? You should have hidden the strat where you, uh, where you put flame will in slot man seek. Dude, people aren't ready for the truth. They hated seek yeah, because that XG told sucks. them the truth. Dude, <laughs> when Juan routes the task, he's gonna find out that I was right. <laughs> yeah, I just need to do the math on like the amount of flame wheels we use versus like, uh, fire blasts and the it's time it takes to switch. It's I feel like you also need to figure out stick in the oh. human factor. <laughs> It's what's definitely your, faster. What's the route even going to look like, too? It's very uh, interesting. I have the route like 95% of the way done. Okay. It, oh, 95%, uh, huh? Well, the real work is actually doing it. <laughs> Routing's yeah. the easy part. Wait, no, that's not true. Routing mm, and also uh, making it happen is both pretty tough. Alright. Sorry, I've never tasked before. Oh my god, I crit the sneasel. Let's. Task. Let's go slash critical hit rate. Maybe I, should, I shouldn't spoil, but we'll be using a fish in TAS. An actual fish. It's not a real fish, dude. 100% a fish. It's not. You don't know what I'm gonna use. What do you mean I don't? Of course Mantine. I do. Mantine That's is not a, a fish. It's not a fish. He's not using the Mantine. Uh. <laughs> He's using the other one that's right there. I'm, Mantine's I'm, I'm evil. Hearing... That's all it is. I'm hearing next year is PSR Marathon. I'm gonna have more call content next year. Boy, yeah, we're gonna have Man Fine Old Fame. Oh no, <laughs> not bad. Where instead of dying to Kale, you just die to not catching Mantine. Alright, this is a test for anybody. <laughs> who knows what SBM, not you guys, who knows what SBM learns at level 47? Chat. Uh, oh hey, look, it's a move that actually works. Cool. Whoa, no oh, way. Oh, right. We did it. Useful move. Is it piss that... kick? It is it piss kick. Like Congratulations. <laughs> what did you just say? Oh, that's what I've Keys calls it. never heard that. What? That's what Keys calls it. Oh, wow. Unbelievable. These guys yeah. don't know anything about Cinco Bingo. So now we just got level 42 off of Venus. So now we will candy. Nice. Alright, yeah, that's a that's also my final move sets on all my pokes, by the way. Hyper beam. Unfortunately. Seventy power, no stab slash. Delightful. Yeah, uh actually I still can't say it. <laughs> Delightful. It's better than bite. Fair enough. Yeah. But wait, hold on. The bite can punch pokes. Uh, Which do you forget the part where Fralgator is not fast? You forgot the part where it also does the <laughs> zero damage? Yeah. I'm it pretty sure- damage, I'm... Espeon's doing all of it for you. Yeah, well, you have two Pokemon, you'd kind of like both of them to do damage in most cases. Uh, that's why I gave it the well, move that does 150 power. Kulava. I got the curly I ranged uh, insane. Well, we, we can't go around Kulava. <laughs> Unbelievable. I didn't Man. even get slash crit. <laughs> My run's, like, decent, and I'm behind, like, two fights. <laughs> Bailey, why? Dude, you, I'm gonna lose so much time in lineup, don't worry about it. I've lost, like, two years, too. That says something about Bailey. Oh, yeah, Gen 3 runs really like labs. Um, for the most part, they're <laughs> in the early game. Uh, in Call of, it's uh, not the early game, but it's still brutal. Yeah. You're gonna see. Okay, I'm just gonna talk about this now. But I have some, a lot of stuff that's going to happen pretty quickly in like two or three minutes where I'm going to go shopping again, buy a bunch of X items, and then I'm going to do a torrent minute because I want torrent for the next area of the game. Oh gosh. It's a, it's a little sketchy, but I'm going to try to do like a weird setup to get it instantly, and if it doesn't work, I just get mega screwed and it sucks. But uh, it it it's pretty. It works almost all the time. I should be fine. But yeah, I have to go X item. I have to go get X items again. Should I take the elevator? No. Damn, this oh. is plus special defense. If someone takes the elevator, they're disqualified. 
I'm gonna take the elevator. Take the elevator. Alright. Take the Have elevator. Fun. Not finishing the race. <laughs> I win. We did it. Croc is the champion. Let's all go to bed. Yay. <laughs> Me taking the elevator is just gonna void the race. That is how that works. Imagine having a controller that can actually like do directional inputs that make stairs viable. You not own a controller. Keyboard no. kind. I just use key keyboard. Keyboard yeah. honestly, I'm from fine with anyways. Do you not? Do you yeah. not like have any? Do you not have a controller though? I think I do. I just haven't connected it. <laughs> So for oh, some context, elevator is about a second slower. I think less than a second, assuming optimal it, movement. It's, it's, a, it's about a second, yeah. Yeah. I'll tell you what's oh. not a second slower. Wasting a million years to go shopping again. I thought you were going to say putting some flame wheel and slap on. Which is faster. <laughs> more than one second faster. I was going to say picking Kawatha. I don't even need to buy extra potions because I have so many potions. So. Go in awesome mode. Uh, I'm also buying X attacks this time because uh, now I have physical moves, so those will be useful, probably. I am currently pulling the memory card out of my GameCube. <laughs> no, why would you do uh, that? Ryzakin is is cheating. He, he's about to go awesome mode. He's Literally about to do the playing with his game. He's gonna do the funniest thing game. in not Coliseum history. Literally the funniest thing ever, ever. Interesting thing about. Losing a battle in this game, like you know how other games usually send you back to the last place you healed, like the last Pokemon Center or something? This game it sends you back to the last place you attempted to save at. You can only save at PCs in this game. So we're, we're going to be doing a lot of in the section coming up. I actually I... take a fake save at the PC of the lab, and we're going to be losing a lot of fights. But we can just go right back to that point. The reason we're going to be losing the fights is because we don't have to actually win them in order to progress. Yeah, Ryzen can actually cool lose them. Does that. Yeah, it saves yeah. about like two minutes, a little over two minutes, than actually trying to win all the fights. If you have a good yeah. secondary poke like Typhlosion though, you can actually win and still go fast. It, it's Guys, slightly it's faster. It's kind of slow to win though. It's slightly faster to lose fights with uh, Fralgator, but um, I haven't really fully timed it, and I, I don't think it's completely worth it because it costs you a bunch of XP and makes it later parts of the game harder. So I haven't run it in yet, but oh, uh -oh. yeah. All right, runs over. I want to give a one shout out to this one JP runner, uh, Tika Exe. Oh, we got left behind. Um, did it. Good job. Yeah, it's faster wrote, uh, now, guys. It's faster. Oh, we did it. Well, she teleports. Not That's right. It's not act. What do you? You didn't know that. that. Even I knew that. Yeah, yeah. so Tika wrote this uh, article in Japanese about what happens when you die to like all these certain different trainers. Um, and that's where I got the idea for dying in lab. Cool. Someone had previously mentioned that you could die to the trainers that fall down, um, but no one ever did anything with it. So yeah, we're going to be seeing a lot of uh, bits that aren't going to be won. Uh, and in fact, Isaac and maybe Quan as, Quan as well are gonna yes. lose faster by doing things while they're trying to fake save at the PC. This is where they're gonna really pull ahead of me. I'm gonna, like, Croc is really slow in lab. They're gonna save a bunch of time over me. I'm hopefully gonna save a bunch of time unless I crit myself like 40 <laughs> times. Yeah, I did a really weird torrent setup there, but uh, it gives me a good high torrent, so it's uh, helpful for me. It's a little slow because typically, well, I, I mentioned my frog is like max speed, so I actually outspeed those two Voltorbs. Usually, you're slower than them, almost always, and it's actually faster. That torrent setup is faster if you're slower than both of them, but um, the high speed is worth others saving time out in other places that uh, it doesn't really matter that the one torn setup is like a 30 seconds slower ish. So yeah, we're gonna begin heading into the lab. Back to Juan. the lab again. Juan, I saw the DNA sample in the place that it would make sense to skip the scientist in that weird way. 
Well, I'm you should have done it. I'm not gonna do it. Coward. Oh, I, haven't, I haven't gotten there just yet. Get the, a... Just get the perfect angle. <laughs> it's not even just an angle, you just hold the right, and then as soon as you hit the wall, you can start holding down. It's free. What? It's not free. There, there's like a... Normally you walk around a trainer, uh, I'm gonna walk around him so you'll see it in a little bit, but... You can, if you have like really, or like, it's kind of weird, but you can avoid him by like hugging a wall, but if you like screw it up a tiny bit, you'll have to fight an optional. So I don't do it, because I don't actually yeah. know how to do it properly. I think I'm the only one who knows how to do it. Yeah, <laughs> and I think it runs. yeah but uh, you actually have to go back through the room uh, right after, so there's a really easy setup for going backwards through it. It's just really hard to go forwards through it. Yeah. You know how to do it, Rise Again? Where you go both ways, skip them both ways? I will do the one coming back if it's presented to me, but not the one going to. I'm an idiot. I did this fight wrong. We've got Rain Dance over on. Is yeah, that was, a, that was a mistake. I uh, I was supposed to double target. It makes target. Surf more powerful. No, I don't use Surf in this fight. <laughs> <laughs> I, was figured, supposed, but... I was supposed to double target the Furret because uh, the Apom can't actually hurt anything, so it just, it just Fury Swipes on Espeon. Uh, I had an upgrade staircase, I don't know about fun. Uh, it's okay. I've made some slow mistakes, but you. decent. Yeah, my, my staircase was like, not the best. So, pretty standard Voltorbs for me, now things are gonna get a little crazy in the lab <laughs> here. Oh gosh. Now you get access to the PC, right? So there's a PC, PC right, right here, together. I'm going to deposit Espeon and Umbreon, so we only have Plusle, and that'll be the fastest way to lose fights. There's going to be a fight right after this next one, we're about to lose. I'm actually going to go in with just Espeon, and we have to win the fight. <laughs> yeah. Uh, there, and it's a um, scary fight. There's, I think, what, three scientists, or I guess researchers, um, and you can't skip those. So if you, that's why he has to kind of alternate back and forth because there's three researchers uh, kind of just mixed in. Only one is required. Was that right? Oh, well, no, actually two are required. There's four researchers, but two useful. Well, well, I meant the one at the beginning. Oh, right, like, right. Before you do the setup. Well, there's five researchers, wow. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go, I'm about to do like what used to be, or, or what is normally a really scary part of this run. But um, if you have bad special attack, there's a really annoying range here on this Magneton. Um, but uh, I have good enough special attack that it's basically guaranteed, but if I miss it, uh, it uses Thunder, and Thunder, if it hits, will just murder fire me instantly. And that's why I need Torrent, so that I can actually one hit KO the Magneton, because Espeon can't. But a uh, single target surf can just oh barely. <laughs> yeah, that's why that's why it's a really weird torrent setup at the very beginning of lab here. If you have like a really, <laughs> if you have a really bulky Fralgator, you can survive the thunder from uh, the electrode, but that's slow and annoying, and you can get paralyzed, and a bunch of weird stuff can happen. And just so closely. So I get torrent at the very beginning, and I crit it oh. anyway. So there we go. So now this fight, I have to win. I want to take a lot of damage on Espeon. It's a Thunder Spam fight. <laughs> it can paralyze, and it can crit, and be really bad. I'm taking the elevator. Hopefully. Let's go. As well. Unbelievable. The scenes. All right, wait. I'm about to do the reverse trainer skip. So it, it, it's really easy to do in reverse, but doing it forwards, it's like impossible. So yeah, you just hold up left to do that, but doing it the other way is really, really hard. It looks easy when you do it that way, but like his vision is just barely on the edge. <laughs> I really hope I don't get the sample in the first slot, because then that means I have to go for it after talking. talking <laughs> yeah, and so I haven't practiced it in so long. There's three DNA samples in the lab. I mean, it's we fine. Two of them. You're running Bailey, if you're going to lose time anyways. <laughs> it's a lot of time to lose, especially since I only have SP on for that fight. You'll get, you'll get extra XP? What are you talking about, dude? Safety, yeah, yeah. Make up for all the experience that you're, you and Ryzen are losing by losing all the battles. True. 
I'm so I'm used not, to your, um... I'm not death range, am I? Not in death range, playing... not in death range. I've been playing too much XD, so I'm so not used to range. this stupid XD map that takes like two years to move the cursor for the first time. Oh, yeah. So, so I'm either over or under it shooting it every time. Yeah. It, it, this, this fight is so bad. It sucks so bad if you get a weird combo. This guy can lead a hound hour, and if he leads the hound hour, it's free. But if he doesn't, then this fight sucks. Also, this Carvana is a range, and if I miss it, this fight super sucks. Did he lead the hound hour? No. Nope. Oh. And I missed the Carvana range too. So nice takeaway little... from from Croc is that a lot of things suck. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's most things bad. actually. Oh, that would have been so good. Uh, it's just okay. That's fine. I'm gonna do that. Be good, actually. That's fine. It missed Scary Face, which gives me a, which lets me get Rough Skin, which will put me in lower Torrent, so I don't level up out of Torrent, which is actually really good. Okay. Bad, I do bad situation. Fight. Would have had a much better setup with that HP, but got fully parried. Luckily, didn't die though afterwards. Now I can bring this lower HP with me into the next fight and lose it. This is a dark type spam yeah. fight. You guys should be ignoring me and watching Ryzakin because what he's doing is way funnier than anything any of us will be doing. Yeah. Here's well, the until, skip until Juan does it. You. What, I was gonna say, what's uh, Ryzakin actually... or Juan? I'm incredible. He hasn't done. A... He hasn't gotten out of the fight yet. He's a true god gamer. No, no, he's doing he's doing the reverse one, not the. Oh, no, never mind. I take it back. That's that's for noobs. That's the free Just one. Do the reverse one and then immediately do the forward one, and then do the reverse one again. <laughs> show that the first one wasn't maybe, fake. Maybe later. I'm on the late sample set, so I'm not going to be seeing a DNA sample till after two more fights. Yeah. So, so uh, the DNA sample patterns are fairly predictable if you, if you see or don't see samples at a, certain spots. There's only three combinations. Oh, there's only three? Oh. Yes. So based off of where the first one is, you immediately know where the other two are. Yeah. And even then, you tend to not actually grab all three. I wasn't even paying attention once the combo here. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, um, a funny thing about, uh, Croc is that I'm the only one who doesn't have a fire type move. And the funny thing about not having a fire type move is that there are more than one, uh, bug steel pokes that are oh, really, really hard for me to kill. So if, if, if there's, if this fortress leads in this fight, it's a really, it's like a really sketchy range to kill it with Surf plus Psychic, and if you miss it, you just get completely destroyed. Because it'll just shatter and rush you to death. Croc just gets owned a lot. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Alright, so Ryzikin's putting in our Ace plus Lee. Again. Hmm. So now we're back to just losing fights quickly. Next uh, three fights. Oh no, I did this backwards. Does this kill? Okay, fine. Ge Oops. I was supposed to target the other thing. Doesn't matter. So, Juan has picked up some more X items. And Ryzen as well as two supers in front of a uh... oh two supers, supers as well. Out of three, <laughs> twenty. Shopping differences with some of the routes is we run out of X items. Juan and I run out of X items after the stairwell, so we got to replenish. I also a little bit do. slow, but unfortunately, that's kind of the only way to make the route work is to split up the shopping trips. So I have enough to finish lab and a little bit extra after that. But since you kind of die. You lose money. Mm -hmm. Oh gosh. So, you gotta shop them before you lose your money. Yeah. We'll walk away from the lab with a little bit of a surplus of money if we needed to buy a couple extra healing items. I don't typically plan to have to shop after this split, though. Yeah. And... Hmm, never mind. I'm gonna say something, but... Uh. Nice, I got fast call. 
saves 18 seconds. Pretty good. Nice. Dude, surf animation is so slow, dude. I'm going insane. <laughs> <laughs> Keep hitting this blast, Saber. Yeah, lab's been going real well for me actually so far. It, I'm only starting, but still. So, so. so okay. I hit all those fire blasts, so, you know. Alright, I'm about to take off the EXP share. We've made it. Welcome to the real world for alligator. It's like that we're barely ahead of Gator again. <laughs> so, Ava's getting psychic now? Yep. Uh, usually you would take off the experience share here, but since I'm playing it safe, I'm gonna be keeping the experience share on for one extra fight. Uh, just so I can get level 50 for a certain fight coming up later. Lame. <laughs> don't. Uh, just don't get that combo. Yeah. True. All right. I I never not I never don't get that combo. I swear I I swear I always see flag on Claydol. I've Wait, saw, I've only see seen it once. I've only ever seen I've it once. No, I've, I've never seen me. it. <laughs> okay, I have something hilarious. If you thought that surf ranges were funny. Get ready for oh psychic range. <laughs> because this grand yeah, everyone has is, that. This grand bowl is really strong. So it isn't even guaranteed to KO it. Nothing bad happens to me if I miss the KO, but uh it's a lot it's a lot slower. Time so now Juan is. Go on. Yeah, now you're depositing everything. So now I just need to not crit myself. I'm gonna crit myself. Oh, I didn't. Yeah. I didn't. I, f I didn't really mention this, but the funny part about having low health throughout like all of Lab and even on Mount Battle to an extent is that most things, even when you're really low health, still can't kill you. It's, I, a lot of pokes don't really have any good moves, so that's I why. Wouldn't, I, I wouldn't say that's, that's true. That's not me. really true, but I don't yeah. know. It, it's true for Fralgator, at least. A lot of stuff, especially in lab, can't actually KO you, which is why there's a lot of places where like stuff just doesn't target you. <laughs> Everything that, kills that uh, lotion in lab. That. Oh, I got saved. The sample is not at the first slot, so I don't have. I can't go for the the good nice. skip. Do it anyways. <laughs> Even though it doesn't really make sense to do it. I would lose time because I need to go get the sample. Oh no, oh, I don't get the have... sample on your first pass and then do... I don't, have a, well, I don't have a chat box open. Where am I going to type my samples? Maybe I'll just remember oh, that. Alright, what, what do you have so far? That'd be way funnier. I'm not going to tell you guys. I'll just remember. It's fine. <laughs> okay. Okay, I can see that one. Yep. No, yep. The, the, okay. I'll, I'll remember it. I'll remember it. And... This is a, this is a test. try to remember mine by okay. saying them verbally. I just won't. <laughs> It'll be fine. It's Isn't faster it? to guess the third key pattern, but uh, yes. In this case, that. you might be guessing a few more than that, Kappa. <laughs> Mighty dog. Just uh, just have the third one be Kualava, easy. What if that was already one of yours? Uh, then you're screwed. <laughs> oh yeah, Kualava's your second key. Probably. <laughs> yeah. If this type lotion isn't faster than uh, than Marco, I'm gonna cry. Alright, if, if you thought it was funny that I couldn't one-hit KO the Magneton earlier, it's even funnier now because I can't even single-target this one. So I literally <laughs> can't one-hit KO it at all. What a neat name. Just, just you a nice try to flame wheel it. You could flame wheel it. My bluefish didn't come with flame wheel. It's unfortunate. unfortunate. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, one took the sample first. First pass, so he's going to do the skip on the second pass, right? Yes. Nice. Yeah, so I'm on that electro uh, or thunder spam fight. Gotta hope for good RNG. Six. And uh, not getting parried. Turn one is pretty good. Pretty 
Okay, that's 88. Okay, I need to use two potions. Yo, they missed Thunder? I didn't know that could happen. <laughs> it's actually slower because now yeah, I have more health to this. <laughs> it's bad for him, for those two. Okay, I'm gonna do another dumb setup where uh, I need precise croc HP again. Oh my gosh. Uh, I can't super potion. It would give me too much health, so I have to use two regular potions. Small so potions. So for the rest are... of uh, Zeke's lab, we're going to be hearing this really stupid alarm sound. Oh yeah, I forgot Any about time that. Using the <laughs> <open world. laughs> All right. And also, well... he's going to need to see if he remembers his uh, passcode soon. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Skip time. All right. Yes. All right. Check this out. We're actually going to use an X attack. <laughs> get owned, losers. That exists as an item? Absolutely it does. And it saves time in this route only. But there was a fight before when Umbreon got Hyper Beam that we would X attack it. No gosh. way. Yeah, it was for the Hound Doom. Oh, that actually makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Can't teach Umbreon Earthquake. See the the problem with like it, it's funny, haha, to like use an X attack, but the unfunny part is that it's actually required because you can't one hit KO this Kecleon without it. Yeah, you'd have a plus one psychic with Espeon if you wanted to one hit KO it otherwise. But I need Espeon to kill other things because Croc can't kill other things. <laughs> Yeehaw. Oh man, I survived with one HP. And it used scary face twice. Oh my god, three turned out. Yeah, that Carbone is gonna keep spamming that, unfortunately, until you're in definite kill range. Is that until a blade? You're minus <laughs> oh my god, I used hidden power. <laughs> like I taught Don't hidden power, HP. but hidden power for me isn't super useful until near the very end because the end is where there's a lot of uh, dark types where I really need to use hidden power. It's only useful in a couple spots here and in, in this area it's actually only for PP preservation. I just need psychic PP so I'm using hidden power where I can. Okay, I remember my two. It's Croc and Odd, my Diana. Yep. Okay, it only took me three tries. I can't complain about lab so far. It's been going fairly smoothly. No real issues. If you thought watching surf animation was funny, wait until I do it twice in this one fight. <laughs> oh my gosh. So basically, you're gonna fall behind. All right, cool. Am I, is, is Razkin not ahead of me by now? No, he's not. Oh. He hasn't inputted his passcode yet. Last try. <laughs> I knew I knew Fralgator was good. But I executed it fairly decently compared to some of my other attempts, so... <laughs> I actually executed it really, really slowly. We got like... Wabafet lead on Scrub for once. For once. Cute. Graveler lead saves me an X-Spec. <laughs> Wow, you can Wobbly hit makes it means I don't have to take damage from a slow triple kick. He used Surf on the Clam Pearl. What an idiot. <laughs> Go Croc, baby. You don't know your tight matchups. Come on. Yeah. Now. Sorry. Yeah, imagine not knowing your tight matchups. Quite sad. You would not survive Gen A. Oh, yeah, it's time to miss. This Fire Blast on Grand Bull coming up here. It's probably the Fire Blast I missed the most. I don't have actual stats on it, but it Definitely feels like the, the one I missed the most. Definitely the Fire Blast I missed the most. The Fire Blast I missed the most is the one on Dunsparce. Uh, which one? Dunsparce. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, I clicked uh, the Wobbuffet. I, I, I crit the Wobbuffet. You only had to watch Surf Animation once. Take that. Let's go. Nice. Let's see if I crit it too. Ah. I think it's a range, but... Two bites. Whatever. Did flinch it, though, which saves one text box. Oh, no, it's not. I'm thinking of Hypoja.
All right, my okay. psychic PP is a little bit low, so if he leaves Sh Golbat, then I have to hit a range. Shifted Ein? What does that mean? It means he has a poke at low health or something, I think. It means you can have his pokes target the Umbreon instead of Espeon, which is a lot nicer because Umbreon has Protect. This doesn't have to range. heal as much. Did not miss Fire Blast and Grumble. Nice. This is... This is what happens, or this is why we buy a, a bunch of full heals. Literally only for this. <laughs> oh gosh. I can't believe we actually went this far without really mentioning Shifted AI. It's really not that relevant for us, because we all have like good status, but... Yeah, I don't yeah. have any Shifted fights. It's also not yeah. super necessary to explain because uh, even if it happens, you wouldn't really, like, people watching yeah. you wouldn't really notice. Yeah, exactly. But what it actually is, is usually a Pokemon will target, like, let's say Espeon, because Umbreon's defenses are pretty good, so Espeon usually takes more damage. But Plusle, since it isn't getting as many levels because Espeon has XP share, eventually gets to a point where Espeon has be a better defense stat. And so things will not target Espeon, and now target Umbreon. Entei Bayleaf are my samples. Entei Bayleaf? Nice. Alright. I hope you like those full heals, because I hope I never see them again. <laughs> <laughs> this gold match just spams Confuse Ray. And I don't want yeah. to use any other moves because then it will hurt me. I learned the hard way that it also cheats <laughs> and knows when you're actually using a full heal to cure it, so it's just gonna I mean, confuse yeah. right again. Yeah, it's awesome. But I I kinda it's fine because Croc I mentioned on uh, Blizzard on Alteria earlier in the run. Two <laughs> half uh two half blizzards I think are a range and a single blizzard is a range, so um yeah, it's just, uh, you just can't kill it. Two Hyper Beams is also a range. Which is, depending on the combo we get, you would just try to kill it with two Hyper Beams. What about Hidden Power chance. Ice? One, this isn't 2005, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Hidden Power Ice is pretty good for Kulava. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's pretty good, yeah. I yeah, it's good, well. though. I, don't, I, I did don't not go it. out of my way to get a Quill with Hidden Power. That would have been. Yeah, I don't have redfish. Sorry, bro. <laughs> oh, I got the bay leaf sample. <laughs> nice. I got You're the, the only one with. Actually, yeah, no. I got the croc croc sample. One. Get owned. Mighty bay leaf. Let's go. Okay, literally perfect iron fight. Not yeah, ask I mean, for better. Let's go. Have you finished? All right. Why is it gonna take the lead? I just killed Altaria. I just won because Altaria's the last one. Cause I ran out of psychics. Anyway. Yeah, this should so, have... Ava's gonna have a quill. Hopefully this is pretty close till the end, because uh, there's a couple really good fights for me in the last area, and there's a couple really awful fights for me. <laughs> and I think I'm beyond a little more consistent, where all the fights are just kind of okay. A lot of the bad fights for me from the actual no snags route are gonna be a little simplified, because I'll be getting the Master Ball and catching some stuff. Not gonna save a whole heck of a lot of time compared to no snags, though, so... So, yeah, I know, you have to go a little out of your way to get the Master Ball. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. kind of slow, unfortunately, but it does save a lot of time, especially the final fight. If, if you thought it was funny watching Juan walk in circles at the very beginning, you're gonna love it. saves a lot of time back, I should say. It doesn't save a whole lot of time overall. <laughs> the, the shadows are the hardest pokes to kill, so catching them is just easier. They also typically do more damage because they're all strong Heck yeah. and have, have good moves because they're supposed to be usable. Anyway, I grabbed, rise again. I, grabbed, lad. Oh, sorry, I, grabbed, uh, I grabbed a TM that Ryzekin. Oh, sorry. I grabbed a TM that Ryzekin did not, if you happen to catch that. Uh, TM, like 11? It's 26. 26. I think everyone yeah. except Ryzekin is going to teach him. Do you I teach don't you get it. More? No, okay. Teach what? Didn't yeah, these two. eons can't exactly oh. use that move. You can try with their little paws, but they're just not going to shake the earth very hard. Yep. 
So, for those of you who don't know what TM26 is, it's Earthquake. Uh, I'm gonna use it for a couple of fights. Uh, Proc is gonna use it more than Quill. Uh, we actually use, I think, the exact same. I might use, like, one more against uh, Evis, but that depends on the combo. Who? Uh, uh, I don't know. Delibird. I don't remember yeah, this no, bit. Right. Sorry, can can we can we go over this bit again? I forget it. So I missed the Kecleon range. It was quite favorable, but oh, yeah. I was gonna say my lab's been super clean, but then that happened. Yeah, you're. I think it's like you miss two fire blasts per run is the average. Yeah, I've missed zero. Oh yeah, we haven't really mentioned any of your misses because you just haven't had any. I somehow, how, yep. somehow Juan has had the most misses out of all of us, Because he has the least accurate move. <laughs> <laughs> well, got uh, the puzzle first try. So Quill? Nice. Oh no, she didn't- oh, I don't remember. Whatever. Oh no, you didn't do Quill. No. Rise, can you fight Dakeem first too, right? Uh, Mirror B, actually. Oh, we're we're at a little divergence. All right. Uh, so you, gonna go <laughs> you can choose the order you fight the all the admins. You're going to be refighting them all. Uh, there's a few that are locked behind some stuff, but the first two are Dakeem and Mirror B. Mirror B, unfortunately, does not replay his theme, so uh, a little sad. Yeah, salsa over. this time. Just uh, yeah, just imagine it being salsa, I guess. Like use your imagination. <laughs> it's almost as good as the NASCAR theme. All right, the reason I do this fight first is because I need my uh, health set up in a certain way to do this fight, and for Mirror B, I want full health. So I will do this fight with my specific health, heal up, and then do Mirror B. They all whiz cash. So yeah, this fight is uh, has weird earthquake AI that I'm gonna be taking advantage of. It also has uh, some other weird quirky AI with it because this clay doll. The reason I have my health set up in this very specific way is because if I was dead to earthquake from the clay doll, it would use earthquake and the whiz cash would protect. So because it's not using earthquake, uh, the other Pokemon in the field is not going to protect. And it is going to use Solar Beam because I am out of death range to Earthquake, but I'm in death range to Solar Beam. So it will use this two turn attack, and because I know Protect, I just get free turns. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's a little, uh, <laughs> there's a little mention of me in the any percent notes here, because uh, during a marathon run, uh, <laughs> I had no part of any Pokemon alive going into the Iron Fight, uh -oh. and uh, that'll make Eltaria toxic. Yeah, that, that's another weird AI cheating moment. Much was learned that day. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Juan's doing the passcode right now. Third try, yeah, not bad. Third yeah, third try, not bad. So we've got a little bit of everything. First try, two third tries, and then a last try. Yep. This one's for the plus one single target surf fans out there. I don't think they exist. You said surf, so I'm not one of them. You need an X special to one hit KO the clay doll. Good job, Cro or Gator. You did it. But yeah, this is why I need extra X items because Gator is useless. So yeah, I uh, couldn't get place here because I died. So. Oh. It was quite unfortunate. Oh, yeah. It's quite unfortunate. Wait, what happened? Uh, I missed the fire blast range on Kecleon. Oh, right, yeah, okay. And, uh, it was very awkward to set up after that, so... Is that... Wait, so you weren't in Blaze for that? I was in Blaze. We're gonna see I, miss, I missed a very favorable fire blast oh. range on the Kecleon, yeah. Oh, Behind oh. fight without Blaze. Oh, like, no. you're gonna get it here, right? It's fine, it's just slow. Uh, yeah, you can just get it off the wall, uh, when the wall buffets out. But yeah, now, now I get to You're go. Going into my deck and fight. I get to There's go to a, lot, a lot of time variance here, depending on what combo he sends out first. 
salsa too. Some baby. are really good and fast, and some lose like a minute. Here's a case yeah. where we hit uh, Wobbuffet with Hidden Power of Fire, and then right after with a weak Razor Leaf. So it'll mirror to <laughs> the Razor Leaf damage. Nice. That's like, well, what if you miss, though? Then you just get out. Then we kind of cry. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what if you crit Razor Leaf, dude? It's a good we also won't cry. do any damage. <laughs> that is true. It also still wouldn't do anything. Two runs in a row got the good combo somehow. Oh my goodness. I got a good mirror B combo, baby. Let's do it. Alrighty. Yeah, now oh. I just need to not get frozen by Ice Beam, which is impossible. <laughs> Never before seen. I have to worry about the frozen Ice Beam as well. It can be scary. It's only if I get Gold Duck lead, because I need to kill the Ludicolos. Gold Duck lead seems to be the most common. I think so. Yeah, that sounds about right. I've like never seen Loudger. I know they can happen. <laughs> just don't happen. Yeah. But yeah, we I Golduck is useless, so I give it free turns. And then it can freeze me, so I shouldn't be calling it useless. So bad anyway. that it's good. Uh, fun fact, because Slash does slightly less than half of Hyper Beam, uh, ranges are better if you use an X attack and Hyper Beam than they are if you use Slash plus Hyper Beam. <laughs> I will not be doing that, even though it's what you would do if you had a really good attack on Fralgate. You'd risk a couple spots like that. I had a scroll in my nose. We're going to pick off the clade all here. Flygon's going to use Earthquake, and it's going to hit the incoming Entei really hard, and Umbreon hopefully finishes it off with Bite. Umbreon KOing things. <laughs> what now? My heart that is full. That is a fight. <laughs> Pekim is probably the most chaotic fight uh, until the ending. Oh yeah, probably. So, something that y'all might be noticing is the Shadow Pokes from the admins are still really... Oh, I because... totally forgot to mention that. Yeah. That was the weirdest uh, blaze setup I've ever done. should kill there. <laughs> if, if you catch the shadows, they'll be replaced with a Pokemon that is the same level as the rest of the team. Which yeah. uh, you don't want. <laughs> I don't actually remember what the others have. I know uh, Venus has a Milotic, but I don't know the other two. Oh gosh, that's terrifying. A uh, yeah. Houndoom? Oh yeah, that makes sense. Houndoom. What do you mean, catch and they strats are OP? Alright, let's see this bite. <laughs> What a meme. Alright, do you guys think I should go for the attack range where I plus one uh, hyper beam the sun floor and if I miss the range I die? Absolutely. What do you guys think? Yeah. I give uh, gave Bailey it. some breathing room. That was cool. pretty much the fastest possible DAC and fight for Umbreon. Sounds really good. Alright, you're gonna love what Raskin does next. <laughs> We're back to uh, PC shenanigans. Oh my gosh. Oh so yeah. These, the, these fights are really slow for Croc. It's t it would be faster to skip these, but I haven't had time to route that in yet, unfortunately. So he's going to save some more time on me. Oh, yeah, th this fight just sucks for Croc because there's three grass types, and I have nothing super effective on them. And I can't one hit KO with some floor. Shout out to Soon just wasting a bunch of Meganian terms by calling. Confused, like and if I heal it out of confusion, it just gets back into confusion. Wait, which fight are you on? Nine. Oh. Oh, wait, it targets the Bayleaf? That's great. Yeah, because it can wing attack. Uh, oh, do a right. damage to it. But it doesn't even use wing attack, it'll go for bite for the flinch chance. What? That's ridiculous. Yes. <laughs> what? If somebody yeah, so it'll... This game. yeah, Golbat's a little weird. <laughs> yeah, there's very there's a couple weird specific spots where the AI is just like really silly goofy. Completely, yeah. Wow, maybe I should teach Morning Sun to save me some potions. Yeah. Red plus all. Wait, what? Also, oh, that's that's a good range no. on some floor. I'm just gonna go for the range. That's a really good range. All right. 
Will Zeke hit the range? I mean, I, I think it's. I think I'm more likely to hit the range, or I'm more likely to miss than I am to miss the range. So that looks guaranteed. Because Type Dream does over twice as much as Slash. That should just kill. Yeah, it does. Good. That was pretty good. Normally you have to protect and it wastes a million years, then you have to use Psychic and it's so slow. That was actually okay. <laughs> I, I totally forgot to mention. This so fight is by Ruid. This this Venus, this Venus fight is so chaotic, but it's only chaotic for me because I need to get torrent from this fight. <laughs> Yeah. That sounds horrible. Hmm, it is. Oh, right, yeah. It, it's like, if one thing does more damage to you, or what, it's really weird shenanigans. Okay, wait, what's my health looking like? I need to... Super quickly, super quickly. 140. Okay, I got the combo. Good combo. Okay. Oh, and I'm not in death range. Perfect. That's slow. I love the death range. Very beautiful. This fight should get perfectly done. I still haven't missed a fire blast. Well, don't keep saying it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna keep saying it. It's working. All right, so yeah, you're missing fire blast is kind of the only way I save time on you. So the, the funny thing about the, this Venus fight is that uh, don't worry, I'm coming, coming up on um, the Keem now. I'm gonna get played off like on lead and miss the 75% range. So you're fine. Okay, so this is like a one in 16 to kill me. Okay, perfect. So I'm just going to heal that off because I want to get hit by it again later. This is a really weird fight because my stats are really weird, but I'll make it work. Okay, and I'm entering Venus now. Too difficult of a fight, and obviously we don't need to get low HP, but we kind of do want some damage, because we're going to be setting up for another Peon Death Warp a couple fights. Yeah, I... Yet another bizarre uh, health setup, because uh, I need Torrent. <laughs> And this is even a little more weird than it usually is because my stats are a little bizarre that I was in Raichu kill range to start the fight and I leveled up out of it during the fight. So I think it's slightly faster this way, but um, it's a little more dangerous because there's more chances for it to crit me. Oh, right, it's not I have Loudred lead. That what? Yes, that's what? He is cheating. Stop this man. <laughs> oh, did, I didn't level up at a kill range, did I? Uh -oh. Another instance where Umbreon's gonna be useful no. for saving animations by taunting something that's expected to use a status move. Good to king. Nice. Right. Three admins down. And one more to go. Yeah, funnily enough, he's the by far the easiest for me. Uh, he has he has a, he has a Pokemon that will if because I'm in uh, the reason I need low health other than Torrent is because it puts me in kill range to uh, one of his pokes and its only damaging move is Dig, so it'll just spam <laughs> Dig, and I can just avoid it with Protect. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, uh, uh, I'm so mine's for this fight. Dig. Very fun to just play around with the entire time. Mm -hmm. Imagine everyone's doing that. Mm -hmm. I'm also saving some psychic PP here because PP gets a little tight around here. So there's a lot of hidden power in, in these next two fights. I believe the hidden power animation is slightly slower than psychic, but it's just I need it for the PP. Now 
Uh, nice surf animation. Mm -hmm. I actually had to see one on my screen, too, because apparently my stats were skewed enough that Suicune didn't want to Shadow Rush. Oh my goodness, <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, it's a, there's a couple of spots where like Shadow Pokemon will change their moves used depending on your stats. I think I've only ever seen it once, but that Shadow Mantine way in the beginning, you know, it's takedown and I've had it use it against me before. Yeah. Yeah, same. You've also seen Bite from Entei or something like that. That was the most chaotic thing I've ever seen. That's because... I, I don't I don't even know. I guess it just uses Bite if it Bite will kill. I, I guess. I get it and it left me like at 1 HP or something? Yeah, it's the exact same thing happened to me. Yeah, the way uh, the game decides if it can kill you... Uh, it either it takes its max roll, and if it's greater than whatever HP you have, it'll just say it can kill you with the move, and might just use it. Oh wait, I totally forgot a cool little uh, tidbit. Uh, it's semi-relevant in Venus, but super relevant here. Um, well, never mind. I don't know why I said Venus. That's a lie. Um, this Rhydon has uh, lightning rod. Hidden power electric is unaffected by lightning rod. Oh. In case you were planning on using, uh, I don't know, Thunderbolt, just randomly here. <laughs> ice, Interestingly ice though, it doesn't affect Hidden Power Electric in this gen. Mm -hmm. Which is too, yeah, which is surprising. But yeah, it all wish right cash. Using this is the bad combo. Uh oh. <laughs> Good luck. Bad combos, oh man. Show me Starmie, please. Yeah, also, everything in this fight is super easy to kill. <laughs> I think for Quilava 2, this fight's pretty super easy. Because Espeon 1 and KO is pretty much everything. Really taking advantage of Lightning Rod being effective here. Specialing Meganium here. And a two hit kill Flygon. Oh, I missed the 15 and 16 on Starmie. Uh oh. Wait, what? <laughs> I don't think that's a big deal for you, is it? It just gives it an extra turn. Kind of annoying. Well, yeah, but I mean, it's not going to kill him, right? <laughs> Because it doesn't like use rain dance or something stupid, does it? No, it right. kills like plus old. Apologies to those who would love for me to have absolute perfect routing uh, because of some stuff I have an extra ether. Feels bad. How dare you! I know. PP routing isn't even perfect. I have to taunt. Oh wait, I'm crazy. Never mind. I forgot. Oh. Jack, I'm the coward. He healed his Flygon. No way. <laughs> wait. I lied. What now? I, I don't know why I said that. It's not even true. Sorry, Bailey will still two hit it. I'm, I'm not even right. Oh Post. yeah, bosses have a chance to use healing items. Some bosses. Some, right. I, I don't All the admins? Yeah. Yeah. So we might see that throughout the rest of this run. Uh, yeah. I'll leave it at that. By the way, Zeke is filling in all the badge colors, and that'll unlock this door, and also set up some more trainer fights. Ralligator is high enough level at this point that it is actually, like, kind of useful in these fights. <laughs> so is this the beginning of Rise Again shenanigans? Oh no, not quite. Anyway, there's a weird thing that's going to happen here. I'm out of kill range against this. Uh, normally, Frowlgator's in kill range to this Ariados, and it would target Frowlgator because of that. Because I am not, it will target Espeon instead, which is not a big deal. I just have to do this fight slightly differently than I'm used to. 
Normally you would uh, protect and then use a single target surf to kill the Aridas. Yeah, this is the part where I'm going to be going back for the Master Ball, but I'm going to do that by saving a little bit of time backtracking by losing this fight. Uh, yeah. Which you can do, but my no-snags route typically doesn't, just because we don't obviously oh catch anything God. with Master Ball. What happened? Sunflora survive? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's so oh, rare with Blaze. Oh, dang. Yeesh. Yeah, everybody's starting to miss ranges left and right here. Uh, this run has actually been really, really good for me. I'll I'll be excited to see the final time on it. Probably like 30-ish more minutes for you and Reskin. Um, yeah. Actually, now your pace is... Yeah. Also, Very good race so far. And stuff like that. I believe no snacks can get... Or, yeah. Or, I guess it's not no snacks, it's snacks. I don't know how bad your Evice and stuff right. are on the new route. I don't know how bad uh, Visa or whatever are on the new one. <laughs> okay, I have a special treat for everybody. If you oh, thought gosh. using an X attack was good and awesome and hilarious, wait till you see me use one on SBR. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> Excuse yeah. me now? I use an X attack on SBR, baby. Wait, what? X attack <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's 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 wholesome. It's awesome. Uh don't use the hyper oh wait, yeah, I'm a full health I'm Eskin going awesome mode. That's right. Good job, SB. This fight has super weird AI and all of our fights will probably look slightly different. But uh yeah, because this thing attacks uh fake out gator, uh I X attack the SB. <laughs> it's really funny. Quite humorous. I missed the wiggly that range too. And I missed the fire blast because I have my special attack is kind of bad. <laughs> yeah, so this one's gonna look a little bit weird. Oh, where no. I'm, I'm not gonna use protect, even though um, I probably should, even though it looks like I probably should use protect to avoid this fake out. And it's because I need to avoid a fake out next turn. <laughs> oh. Yeah, basically, um, with, with the way my health is right now, Everything targets for alligator in this fight with fake out. I think that's just because they can kill it, so they target it when they use fake out. I believe. Sounds believable enough to me. And then you go for a little double protect here, saving those protects for turn three, baby. And Master Ball in hand. How are you going to get all the way back? It's such a long trip. He's going to walk. Oh, so lame. <laughs> Imagine if you could just wipe and immediately be transported back into real game. Oh, you'd yeah. be shocked. You can wipe yeah, to the old man. And uh, yeah, yeah, there but, is a trainer you can wipe to in Agate, but, but it's slower. It's definitely slower. Is it? That's, yeah. Is it? I think so. I thought you were gonna do it. Man, I was hyping you up, and no? Alright. Alright, I'm about to do the worst fight in my road other than Venus. It's Gonzap time, baby. Venus time oh. for me. Gonzap. Alright. Yeah, Gonzap is super annoying for mostly just for Fralligator because he has uh, two dark types. Yeah, I have a over on your end. Uh oh. I've had the worst Venus and everything of all time. Oh. I missed- I had to Fire Blast Blossom, or I was better off doing it. I missed that Fire Blast, and I missed the 75% range, Psychic range, on Wigglytuff. Oh no. <laughs> you know, as you do. Explosion things. Just an average day at work. 85 accuracy forehead. Yeah, it's funny. This is why you shouldn't have kept saying you haven't missed a fire blast yet. <laughs> but I haven't missed a fire blast. Oh, well, now I have, yeah. Shit. Oh. Okay. 
I hadn't. Well, Meganium is in love. I love just randomly looking all over the place and seeing some really strange things, such as Isaacin using an X to fend on <laughs> Plusly. Saw that, did ya? What? X to fend? You don't need to use an X to fend there. Yeah, well, I need explanation. Yeah. To help it live a fake out. Okay. Sometimes you can get away without even healing Plusle in the middle of the fight here, but I think I will anyway, to be safe. All right. Plusle has to take two fake outs. It protects the third one. Uh, so it's the XFN versus, like, just potioning? Well, you're always full HP going into this fight on this route, since you died from, uh... Peon. Alright. I got the two dark types lead, let's go. <laughs> oh gosh. I might have set up Blaze again with Suicune, sir. Oh yeah, yeah it so does nothing anymore, because it's so unleveled. This, this combo does this really annoying thing where they all target Espeon. So, for the first time, they are targeting both targeting a poke, except it's Espeon. <laughs> Everybody watch Meganium kill, uh, Bailey, er, kill Suicune. It's gonna one-shot. Alright. We love giving... Uh, alligator free turns by protecting Espeon. Yeah, and it's still not going to do anything with them. That fucking catastrophe fight? That's hey, hey. Oh, oh true. If, if Frowligator has God Attack, it's a range to one or to two hit KO the uh, shift tree. Nice, nice. Nice. <laughs> yeah, a lot of his pokes have Earthquake. Uh, Generally, hope for a combo where Shift Tree will get hit by an earthquake so that you can KO it from uh, with the uh, Hyper Beam from that help. Oh! <gasps> no! Uh, that's not that big of a deal, but that sucks. That's gonna cost me like a minute. Let's go. Uh, Rise is gonna I think, catch up. I think Espeon I lost got, more than a minute on Venus. Oh man. <laughs> Espeon just got crit by Shadow Ball. That's not a. That's not gonna sink my. That's like that's not a huge deal, but that's annoying as hell. That's really not that big of a deal. All right, Chad is trying to figure out who wins in a fist fight, Vikim or Gonza. What do y'all think? Gonza. All right. Gonza. XD Gonza. I'm gonna say Gonza because. Not only is his body, like, clearly built, mm -hmm. his facial hair is also built. Oh, absolutely. So, yeah, gun zap for me. Okay, well, puzzle dying means I have to change up some stuff a little All bit right. later, but... Juan and Navar on the same fight. Go. Oh. oh. Man, that sucks, though. I lost, like, two minutes on Venus, Juan. <laughs> Damn. I'm about to Nothing. lose two minutes because I gotta go get Master Ball, so it'll be fine. <laughs> oh. This means you gotta lose another two minutes. Uh, I'll try. Probably a little Let's less try. because what? Because one's actually gonna use the Master Ball. I'll, I also have to lose a million seconds because Puzzle's gonna gain a bunch of levels. Mm. Oh, never mind, I lied. It's gonna die. Let's go. Nice. We, we want it to die. Wait, do we want it to die? It doesn't really matter. And you don't. You don't want to kill it. It's just adorable little rat. A rat? For the sake of XP. Wait, what's a rat? Bustle. Well, Espeon's a rat, too, but it's a bigger rat. Espeon's a dog. <laughs> Same thing. Is it a fish? Well, that too, but I didn't want Juan to yell at me. Oh yeah, do y'all want to hear a linguistics joke? I would yes, love that. My sister taught me. So, it turns out, uh, you can spell fish as G-H-I-T-I. -I. Y'all want to know how? Yes. All right, so take the GH from like rough, for example. Then, all right, take an I from somewhere. Doesn't really matter. Then take the TI from ignition. That's fish. Whoa. 
<laughs> that checks out. <laughs> it checks out. Sound logic, yep. Alright, anyways, uh, Zeke's doing a lot of menuing because he's not gonna do any more of that, uh, after this. Teach the... Also teaching Earthquake, yeah. Yeah, baby. And also and, uh, setting up his party. For the rest a little bit of, of shuffle round. there. Uh, this would look better if Hustle didn't die. <laughs> but, um, yeah, Hustle will be alive because it'll get healed later, but I don't actually need it for now. Uh, it's a little bit safer to have it out front. To start, I could have used my last revive on it, but I would like to save my last revive because oh using a puzzle here doesn't really matter. Yeah. So yeah, everyone's going to be doing a lot of organization on menuing here in this section. Oh yeah, so, uh, Reskin's next. Interesting enough, I don't reorganize. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't have anything leading. to do. I'm going to be leading. Wait, really? Really? Okay. I did not know that. <laughs> yeah, because uh, the one dangerous thing that usually targets us beyond will let target the Bayleaf instead. <laughs> uh, I actually don't think that's true. Isn't it? I don't know. I lied. Sorry. I just like making stuff up. I thought it'd sound cool if it was true, though. I need Bayleaf so I can Master Ball Glitch. Right. And have SB on attack stuff in the same turn. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right. You can't have it in slot one. Yeah, speaking of Master Ball Glitch, there's my first use of it, getting that Skarmory. Oh, no. I kind of kind of scraping my way out of a bad situation on Gonzat myself. Worst combo, worst turn one possible He's in that situation, shooting. so that was fun. Umbreon hit a double protect, which saved it from death, so I was able to catch the bird. Yeah, for those who don't know, uh, X uh, success rate goes down each time you successfully use it. So I'm gonna... I think I have to heal here, because I think this attacks me. Uh, if I had Puzzle up front, uh, I wouldn't have to use this item here. Because it would've just killed Puzzle instead. Just don't die for it. Gotta get the case 3 quest here. Look, I'm trying my best, dude. <laughs> <laughs> my, my menus are out of whack now, my pokes are in the wrong order, and my items are in the wrong order. Funny enough, I bought two XP at the beginning and didn't use either of them. Those are mostly for safety, which is why they didn't show it. And another email on one side, and then the Master Ball. Except you're gonna see me talk to uh, Pikachu <laughs> for a million years. Yeah. Oh. Bigga bigga. Right, now we go back quick. We need to catch up, Ava. Gotta go fast. Yeah. You can catch yeah, up. Zeke I'm and I back out in the open air. I oh, just I just fight one. I just drove right. to Shadow Lab, not Real Game. So. Raz can saves time on me on all these fights, I believe. Maybe except for Quest, the Mountain fight. The but most. He's... Raz can's gonna save a bunch of time on me here. I guess I've run well <laughs> because. Uh, Croc can't kill anything in here, so this is like the Espeon show, as if the whole run wasn't, but even more so. <laughs> Imagine if uh, if we did this race, but you couldn't use Espeon. Uh, I will choose not to imagine it, actually. We do not <laughs> want to be a part fair of enough. that. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. I wouldn't be part of it either. Someone so. was crazy enough to do an only Umbreon uh, run of this. Oh well, let's yeah. Not, well, let's not talk about it. Yeah. Anyway, this is the cool fight where there's three dark types, so it's impossible for me to do anything quickly. <laughs> Thankfully, I can one KO one of the pokes in this fight, but only one of the three. Not a good success rate. Oh, that range on Absol is beautiful. This is going to be a two turn. Nice. Uh, yes, Espeon is like a hard carry in this run, so uh, not having Espeon Except would... Except for Typhlosion. Uh, Typhlosion's really good. Okay, Typhlosion's pretty good, yes. But there's only one Typhlosion on my screen, so... <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure why. The Umbreon only sorry. run had a lot of toxic use, that's all I'll say. Yeah, <laughs> no, let's, don't, don't. It, it, it's not like it was a speed run. <laughs> I mean, that's... 
Hey, Toxic is a speedrun strat. Talk to the talk to our uh, Ultra Moon Runner in, in the Ultra race Moon right now. Ultra isn't a real category or a real it's game. Really, <laughs> Sorry, right. a real speedrun. Yeah, Umbreon only if, is uh, more of a challenge run. Moon. It's a pain run. Yeah, it's basically the challenge is can you survive the pain? All right, Ultra Moon Runners. Uh, Plusle is like uh, the Zorua, I think is how that works. Yeah, it's yeah, fair enough. It's actually, I mean, Zorua is more extreme, but yeah. <laughs> the only thing I know about Ultra Moon is Halucha and Zorua. I don't even know if they use Halucha. Sorry. They use Halucha. Yeah. They yeah. Do. Okay. Halucha, okay. Good. Halucha fling strats. You fling fossils. Yes. <laughs> yeah. It's actually really sick. I love Ultra Moon. <laughs> ironically, the coolest Pokemon speedrun. It's, it's just so good. Nobody runs it. It's too what, long. What do you mean the coolest? You're Wish literally I had watching some way to run me. It. You're awesome. literally watching me run Croc. What could be cooler than this? How is that cool? Dude, check this Even out. If Bayleaf you thought, is cooler. If you thought Surf hitting two pokes at once was awesome, check out me <laughs> using Earthquake and hit three pokes at once. <laughs> <laughs> I do not think using cool Surf was do awesome. That. How did oh, you know that's, that? That there is a fight you're gonna save a lot of time over me. <laughs> Master oh. Baller, no. Yeah, this fight really sucks if uh, you don't have something that knows Earthquake because Houndoom is pretty hard to kill with SB. Yeah, I routed out Master Ball and then Houndoom was a pain, so I routed it back in. <laughs> now we're back here. Also, this is a range. The Houndoom is a range, but it's super favorable. I just got one caught on Karyama combo for Gonzap and then I'm fine. Earthquake's faster, and also it doesn't die to Surf, because Surf gets its damage cut in half. What if you crit not. Espeon? I think uh, I've done that before, actually. If you, if you crit Espeon, then I think you would just you would have to heal somewhere in the next fight, which would lose some time, but like it wouldn't be Oh huge. wait, you don't die to it. Okay, never mind. That's lame. It would only be a problem if, uh, like, if you got crit by Earthquake and then the next trainer led Cac turn, I think, would be the only problem. No bad lead. Oh yeah. Bonsap with Quill is so much easier than whatever <laughs> Zeke was when, doing with Croc. It's, like, it's better, it's the best, like, Bonsap for sure. Like, it's better, yeah. than, it's better than Umbreon, it's better than the, the green thing. <laughs> the green, <laughs> in other words. Grassfish. Grassfish, yep. But yeah, like, uh, having Typhlosion to kill those dark types is huge. And a grass type, so... Or bug types, yeah. I mean. Yeah. Yeah, there's, a, there's a bunch of bug types, there's, and there's the grass types uh, at the end here. Yeah. And then Espeon takes care of the Crawdon, because Espeon yeah, and, is in Power and Grass. Yeah, and it has, yeah, grass. Hidden Power Grass is funny. Alright. This, this fight has some of the funniest AI. In my opinion, because the Cradilly will oh, target yeah. the Cradilly will target for alligator, but it knows Giga Drain, but it almost never uses it. It'll use Sludge Bomb. I don't actually know why, but it is fun. May know why? I think it's something to do with whether it's low HP or not, and it's a healing move. It's oh, really right. dumb, yeah. but that's that, I think <laughs> how it works. That's silly. But it's helpful for me, other than the fact that it can poison, which loses a million years if it happens, but it didn't happen, so it's fine. And I get to use another X attack, baby! On yeah. which poke? That's this the one's real for question. The, this one's for the fans. You'll never know. Will I hyperbeam the Cradilly? Stay <laughs> yeah, for the fans. Oh, hey, look, right. it's a Pokemon that Espeon can do zero damage to. Crazy. Oh, what might do damage to it? Hmm. A move with 90 accuracy if it happens to actually hit. This is one of the worst Hyper Beams in the run, because if you miss, he this thing is uh, it doesn't have really strong moves, but they're super effective, so they murder fry you. All right, Ava's teaching Earthquake now. That's the last. That's the last Hyper Beam of the run. We've hit my goal. Woo! Congratulations. All 
All right. What Who level is that hustling right now? What the? <laughs> Who wants to help me sing NASCAR's theme? Yo, chat. Well, I've, I've, I've been in. singing NASCAR's theme this entire run. Whose audio do we have though for the game? Uh, I'm unmute stream and find out. Don't, just don't pipe on NASCAR. <laughs> oh, we have Juan's audio right now. Oh, then we might have to wait till I get to. Or do That's we fine. We can explain audio? the. We can explain the. We can use the first couple of NASCAR fights to explain what the heck's <laughs> going on before we actually do the, sing the song. Yes, that's. I think that's probably the best way to go about this. Yeah, it's, uh, it takes a lot to sing beautiful, this song, and we won't be able to beautiful. explain the fight at all. So yeah, yeah. I have no. I have no idea what my pace is because I don't have a timer up, so I'm getting nervous even though I have no idea what my time is. Doing really well. I'll just leave it at that. It feels pretty good. On pace to win. <laughs> Hopefully. Evans can go pretty, pretty good for Brock. I hate to say at this point. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, that's expecting okay. the twenty dollars you promised me for throwing. Um, <laughs> what now? Wait, you're supposed to say that after we leave. Oh my <laughs> god, one, <Juan>, dude. <laughs> uh oh. Well, that's not a big deal. Here's a super funny strat where I use Psychic on a Gardevoir. Haha. <laughs> that's quite hilarious. I mean, even Quill does that. Oh, I only do it for this one combo. Oh, X specials, uh -huh. NASCAR is using X specials. Yeah, that's uh, losing some time for me, but it's not a big deal, so. Yeah, so that's an item that NASCAR can randomly use. Uh, yeah. And Angus has killed the Metatite. So yeah, had a lot of different leads so far. So well, actually, everyone's using a different one, right? Yo, Hariyama just crit Krada and Bailey. That's not true. <laughs> Boy, didn't crit Espeon though. That's the one that matters. <laughs> I've only seen three crit once in my life. Dude. By the Plusle. Yeah. All right. How many times has Plusle died this run? Here That's comes crazy. the earthquake. Not enough. Hope, hope you guys like earthquake. Not enough. Fair enough. I love earthquake. I'm a big fan. Good. Let's see, here comes NASCAR for me. Let's see what combo we have to deal with. I can't. I can barely concentrate. I'm just jamming out to the music. <laughs> Dude, yeah, it's such a banger. You can barely concentrate. All right. So I, this is a little bit of a weird fight. Um, actually, that's not that bad. I'm gonna... If I miss Hyper Room here, there wasn't supposed to be a Hyper Room here, but because of the way this fight worked out, there's gonna be. So, uh, don't miss. That's fine, you're fine. Yeah, this fight went super weird from uh, the X Special to the to the Hyper Potion, which I believe the Hyper Potion's random, isn't it? Uh, yeah. So I just kind of got weird luck in this fight, but... Alright, just still didn't miss one. We're good. All right, good Beautiful. job on hitting your second, uh, final hyper beam. If you don't have to hit a third final hyper beam, there, there's no, no way that I would ever use one against Evis. So we're good. Ooh. Uh. I don't know. Anyways. Sorry. <laughs> All good. Short NASCAR. Short NASCAR. Okay. Like that. Can we get like a conspiracy theory about how he's Rui's dad or something? No. Good. <laughs> that would be also quite odd, considering Egon is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that'd be, that'd be good. I'd like that. Isn't Egan her grandpa? I'm an, I'm an idiot. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But but like if he was related to Egan, that'd be awesome. There's a chance. There's, there's still a chance. I like it. Also, I'm an idiot. And, like, there's only like no three way. people in this game, so like. I, I did that for the fans. The probably all. For animation. I didn't need to. Oh, I should. Great. I should use an X back and sister, but. Always do it for the fans. Loses me like eight seconds. It's not a big deal. 
It, it's fine for the visual experience because you just want to torture the Bailey friend over in the other corner of the screen. Uh, there's just like a lot of small stuff. When, um, when I get nervous, I make small mistakes. That's fine, don't worry. So, so we guys. Either way, you're done with the run. Congratulations. Don't worry, you're not gonna throw this. See? I believe in you. The boss? Hey, hey, look, it's uh, uh, with Egan's oh, son. Hey, it's the. It's, yeah, <laughs> it's Egan's <Egan's> son. son. <laughs> Yeah, this is a uh, Egan. Uh, I am Egan Jr. and I will rule the world. Okay. I. Is... Anyways, uh, so turns out <gasps> he's evil. Uh, hey, what a twist! Screw what evil. a twist! What a twist! The nice mayor that was talking to the evil guy at the very beginning. Who would have guessed? Oh my gosh. I mean, it was Mirror B though, like, who has a cool hairdo, is he really that evil, he just wants to dance. Anyways, uh, this is the final fight, the real final fight of the run. Uh oh. I shouldn't have said uh oh, there's a strat for that, we're good. Everything is fine. Uh, X attacks, okay. Yeah, so we'll we'll be snagging every shadow Pokemon here. Hey, look, I double protected. I double protected on purpose. Are you proud of me? <laughs> All right. Does it really count as a double protect, though? <laughs> Technically. Wait, what the heck? That counts as a as an attack turn. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I know. What nice crit happened. on the plus lead. It's really nice that it does count. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Blocking is like a terrifying poke, except for the fact that it's got a really dumb nature for itself. Evis, Evis is just terrifying in general. Uh, yeah. Some combos where uh, certain things can happen, and uh, it's kind of end your run. Wait, I did this wrong. There's no uh -huh. way. I don't think it used earthquake, does it? Uh oh. Uh, what happened? Did it? No, we're fine. That's my thought. We're good. Good. I technically did it wrong, but it doesn't matter. Dude, you got another crit. Stop. Stop. You're scared. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> yeah, now's not the time to be getting crit. Alright. Yeah. Razikin's turn to fight Evice. Uh, how do I want to do this? Which combo, buddy? Um, oh, right. I don't exactly know how I want to do this. I want to. Five turn fight would be nice. Uh, let's see. After the next attacks little... here could be a five turn. A little bit of improv, we're good. There's nothing that can actually kill me unless I, like, totally screw up here. Um, Welcome sick. to the real Colo experience where you just kind of improvise the final fight. Because mm -hmm. yeah. something did not go well. You're Fine. about to die if you mess up. Yeah, Mind I just words. have I just have to uh, not make a really dumb mistake, so it's fine. This is gonna be like an eight turn at us, but as long as I don't die, it's fine. Ooh, Espion got crits. Makes it awkward. Which fight? The Sharpedo. Oh. Uh, Absol fight. Right. Yeah. Maybe the next fight I start with Bayleaf or Meganium. Ooh, actually, what, what, what's in slot 3? Probably Meditate. Probably. It looks like Umbreon from what I just saw on your screen, but I'm uh, probably wrong. Umbreon should be in the PC. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, then. I'm super wrong. Okay. You did it. I can't lose from here. Let's go. Ooh. GT? GG. GG's. Nice that was done. a really, really slow final fight. <laughs> that was terrible, Stuffed, but, but it works. It is fine for a marathon. I'll take it. Yeah. I feel like all these runs have been okay for marathon, honestly. 
The X attacks threw me off. Dude, just like the notes are a mess, so they're hard to read when you're trying to do things fast. Yeah. Uh, it's just so many things that can happen, and you also have to account for when it happens, so. <laughs> yeah. This is Kahlo. If you were and, wondering uh, why the notes man. are long. <laughs> I this know. is just this is just a beautiful ending for all the Frowliator lovers out there. I'm here for you because I'm going to hit the surf range on Tyranitar and the final move of the run will be a single target surf. <laughs> oh my gosh. If you don't if you don't hit the range, just do another single target surf. Just call Espeon or something. It looks guaranteed, but sure. I promise. Thanks. There it is. Okay. Or actually no, even better than that. If you somehow miss the range, hyperbeam it. No, because <laughs> heal. I, I can't do that. He'll heal. Okay, fair enough. Actually, no, wait, they don't heal shadows. Never mind, I'm an idiot. I lied, sorry. I, I learned that. How dare I learned you. they didn't heal shadows. Yeah, they don't heal shadows so that they're not impossible to catch. I don't know anything about this game. Really? And Fralligator finishes at level 51. Beautiful. All right. I'm just coming up for Zeke. GG. Yeah. GG. So this and is proof that Croc is number one? Coming up soon. Yeah, this was for all the fish lovers out there. Who's paid actor? I mean... <laughs> Waterfish I, I had a 1 in 256. Guys, guys, one. Oh, come I, on, dude. I died if, to, to for it. If not, I would have got in first place, dude, obviously, you know? If you keep, if you oh, keep yeah, talking okay. if you keep talking about this, I'm only giving you 10 bucks. Except the 1 in 256 <laughs> sorry, sorry. didn't really matter. Final flinch though on Slow King. Hey, the 1 and 256 did lose me time. Didn't even lose you that much time. Yeah, I was gonna say it barely mattered. Hey, there was. Hey, those animations. True. Alright, fine. Yeah, those animations, they were the deciding factor. Uh, let's see. The uh, time will be coming I, as soon as I say it when it happens or what? Yeah, just like you're gonna have to say it. Alright. Got this. Wait, wait, but the, they, sh they shouldn't stop the timer, right? Uh, uh, the overall race timer will keep going, uh, but whatever Zeke finishes it with we will it. display. What do we What do we got? 339.55. Oh my nice goodness. And done. No That's way. Not bad. Holy. Level 340 for a marathon? With Croc? That's a, that's amazing. Dude, that's really solid. I'm yeah, really your run was super that. solid. I'm really happy with that. I was pretty afraid coming into this because I was terrible during practice. Got that's about one more minute till time on me. Oh, I can't believe he's going to get like a 341 with Umbreon, did he? <laughs> <laughs> this is definitely better than either of the practice runs we did. Last yeah, week. like pretty significantly. Yeah, that's just kind of how it goes. All right, oh, Shen with the big raid. Shen with the raid. In time for the end of the cola run. So let's shout out some of the rest of the cola community because we just got one big runner who just came in, and that's Shen. Uh, I also see Mockwing, Jordan. In chat, they're not necessarily known for Cola, but they are Cola runners. They also Salsa, as well as all of us here. Uh, any words that y'all want to say while we kind of get a little break from action on Ava? Time once. Don't give me a Caesar lead. Don't give me a Caesar lead, please. Ava <laughs> <laughs> uh, loves uh, Caesar. I always get yeah. so run boost. It's so sad. Yeah. No, sorry. We all no, enjoy sorry. salsa. <laughs> 341 with Umbreon, man. That's awesome. Did great job. Yeah. It was very difficult to keep up with a croc, that's for sure. <laughs> Ava's pretty not far behind, too. Yeah, I lost like two years in Coliseum, and then I lost two years on Venus. If I didn't lose so much time in Colise uh, in Pirate Coliseum and. Yeah. And Lab uh, as well. Uh, well, that wasn't that bad. Stairs? I don't actually know what happened. Of course, I, of course I get scissor lead. It's not the worst scissor lead, but... Champ, okay. So, I also have... I read my, 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 my Meditite's defense correctly. 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> if I uh, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. I trust you. You're, you're a good reader. You're good at reading. This. The last time I did a run, I didn't read it correctly. I'm not going to run here. Every time. Oh gosh. I'm scared. Come on, Cesar. Target Meditite. You know you want Sunday. to. Um. And you know you also don't want to get Silverwind boost. Yeah, Silverwind. Uh, has a 10% chance to raise all of your stats. Uh, Guys, by the way, uh, let's go. Let's go! Oh, oh yeah! Well, Chat. um... Chat, join in. I'm seeing Nascor's thing. I, uh, Everybody can sing along. Targeted, targeted Espeon, by the way. Oh, dang. Everyone F. sing along. That must have been, like, super close. I don't know. I... Definitely made sure to check. That Are you missing the XP or something? Are you like under level? Oh, maybe, maybe I'm actually I'm like just under leveled. What level are you? I can't see right now. I just leveled up, so it would make sense if I was under leveled. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh. That sucks. Yeah. Well, it's time to adapt, I guess. Always feels satisfying to flame wheel that bug though. Oh yeah, isn't, for sure. Isn't that the only fight of the f of the five that you don't uh, have to refight all the trainers if you lose? Yeah. <laughs> Much. Look, on, look on the bright side. Uh, I want to. I want to know what level everybody's puzzle finished at. By the way. Mine was twenty-one or twenty. Let me see. At twenty-one. Mine's 16. I think it and should be. It was be docile 17. nature. Oh, I didn't even check my nature. Come on. Gentle. Cool. Oh, I got X attacks there. Okay. Ooh, uh, naive meditate. Awesome. Hmm. I didn't realize how bad my Frail Gauger's defense IV is. It's pretty awful. <laughs> nice overgrow there, Juan. <laughs> Sorry, I'm singing. I'm also singing. Rise is getting where are you going? Where are you? <laughs> I'm just exploring real game. Don't don't mind me. Maybe maybe I'll do something stupid. I don't what what is there in this game that some people might not know about? Oh, I'll go get the, uh... Oh, I don't even remember what you call it. I ran Croc. Mm. We don't have to talk about it. <laughs> on which fight are you on? I'm singing. I'm just trying to lose the Evice as fast as possible. <laughs> One does not become a good trainer simply by battling without strategy. Ooh. I got oh, the strips. 
Strategy Mimo. That was some great singing, Randall. I'm yeah, glad sing I to you, on. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Like, that what was the best game of the game. Can you guys do um, videos, please? So, so now Why that I'm done singing, Ava, what happened? Are you okay? I wiped to Ava's. <laughs> oh no! I might oh. just. I don't know. We'll see what I do. Oh. Uh, at least you start with uh, Nat, uh, Eva, so you can probably just get X items and go back into the fight. Yeah. You have plenty of time. Did a PC save at the under? Interesting. Yeah. The... I just that's saved bad. before that's Venus. Good. That's oh, a good right. save. I didn't think about that. Do I need more than three X, spe X specials for you? I don't think three is. Three is you can get away with two, honestly. Yeah. yeah. That's a good well, three's idea. Fine, what are you yeah. doing? Zeke, what are you doing? What? You guys never seen the Strategy <laughs> Mima before? Strategy? Uh, uh, I see a fr- oh no, you reset. Okay. I split XP on, um, on Venus. That's where I split XP. That just made my SP on not the, be the correct level. Oh, okay. I totally forgot about the save file. And get a real display of Quilaba's power. Uh, what, what Coliseum? The Under Coliseum is pretty cool. Oh, hey! Uh, the Resigan's well, doing oh. the. Shen just raided, so shout out, shout outs to Shen. Yeah. Shen's one of the top call runners. Uh, yeah. He's had some of the most entertaining clips of random things happening that just happened to be. <laughs> happened to happen? I don't know. I don't know why I said it like that. Scizor's dead. So I'm in the clear? Question mark? Let's go. Alright, alright. I, I I don't know. This is the one combo I never got in practice, so... <laughs> I'm sure nuts for it. I trust Ryzikin's notes, though. You're good. Weezing and Grumpig. I don't know if I can beat those. Not with that attitude. Yup. Made us thick fat. All right, well, we're going to sack Bailey if we don't need Bailey. Please and sub. Oh, never mind. We're not sacking Bailey. Bailey is living. Actually, wait, this is that's good. Wait, Bailey living is good. Uh, what's the play? What's the play? What's the play? Hit the thing. Hit the thing. Okay, that's thing. it's time for you guys. The second time around. <laughs> All right, Ava, you got this. Uh oh. Oh, you just knocked my sub into blaze, dude. Uh, it's a save file that's just passed around in the Yeah, it's, Shen, it's Shen's save file. Yeah. Uh, named his Moltres and Charizard, please, and sub. Don't yeah. give me a scissor lead again. Yeah, Ryze can use his RNG go <laughs> Yeah, hopefully no scissor lead. Scissor's like the yeah. one Pokemon yeah. that could do major damage. Actually, have to get more of those birds, one shot. Because I actually wrote over that save to make this one. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. Is that how that? I don't think that's how that works. I don't have a. I don't even have a clue, but this is where Ryzen can. You need to get a Wii and modded. I've been bugging you about a PC, and now you have a PC. Get a Wii. Whoa, 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 whoa! Cheating? I have a Wii. It just doesn't work. <laughs> I have a Wii. I just <laughs> get a working oh, I, Wii. I should. I should have mentioned this. Uh, <laughs> this is just a little funny story from before, but like two days before today uh i bricked my wii so i had to use a gamecube for this let's go yeah I'm you're on a superior system mm, i don't know about that one uh, it's uh not really right about that one but okay that means we have more right. gamecube runners in this call right now so i don't right. think i can lose now i just kind of have to hope it doesn't heal i'm, I'm, I'm trying to educate people on the plot and of I this don't, game i don't need to dupe the master ball anymore let's go Nobody is supposed Skarmory. to Skarmory! <laughs> yes, and if the turn doesn't end show. here, it won't get sand damage, so you get time save. If you get bad range luck. Hey. Yeah. We got all the starters today. So, Ava's on oh, Quill, Juan's on Bayleaf, Zeke's on Croc, and Ryskin's on Umbreon. We're trying to learn about silver right here, is. Oh, you're reading up on the lore? Let's go? Yeah, I'm trying to learn more about this game. <laughs> you 
No, there's a chance <laughs> it heals because it did it die to sand, jerk. Oh my god, it no. heals. Ah, let's go to the heal. Let's go. In there. Wait. It just wanted to use water blaze, but it, this cutscene uh, happened now. Died. I think this cutscene is for right now. <laughs> Morganium definitely Dude, ran. Let's go. Me. It was an oh. adventure at the start. I love sub that four, sub estimate. So we take those. Everyone's gonna be sub estimate. Nice. In in fact, this one just went down on Ava's side. So definitely, let's go. The time's coming up for me soon. I think I've reached my goal of not getting completely owned. Yeah, yeah. I got owned by Evis. <laughs> <laughs> That's my only complaint. I hit all my hyper memes. I got owned by Kale. It was like turn three Kale, yeah. so I lost like two minutes at the start of this race. But oh, I totally everything else was that. decent. And he still recovered yeah, was... really well. And yeah. Isaacin met his goal of his internet just not like crashing. <laughs> So I don't want to talk about those. my internet. I met that goal. The door is locked. Alright, it's not your fault though, so... That's okay. I'm happy we gotta show all the starters. Something I've been wanting to do for so long. I'm just like a bundle. I've been like a bundle of tech issues so, for the past you week. everything about running Hollow, you can choose whatever Pokemon you want. Except for Croconaw. And... Don't take Croconaw. <laughs> Time! Yeah, Zeke <laughs> only won because he G1. paid us all money to throw. I only Jeez. pay you money, dude. Stop. You paid me money to run Umbreon, so... That's not the same as paying you to lose. It's uh, kind of the same thing. Kind of. I don't think so. Uh, yes. Uh, Zeke's doing laps around the, the circle thingy. And... Mm -hmm. Do you want to get a fortune told? How close is your uh, Meditite to purifying? Oh, I reset. Oh, well. Sad. I've Logan for starter confirmed. <laughs> Dang. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah. I shouldn't have wiped Davis. Then I would have made the second to last. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Fortune. Um, anyway. Typhlosion is by far the best <laughs> if you're going to run this yeah. game. Yeah, do run Typhlosion if you're going to yeah. pick up this game. If you've learned anything from this uh, from this race, it's that Typhlosion is the only poke that actually has any killing moves outside of Espeon, so... Yeah, the things that went smooth Trust. went really smooth, but the problem is that the things that went bad went extremely bad. <laughs> Typhlosion <laughs> is the way... Yeah. Typhlosion is the way to go. Go for the Honey Badger. Or Ombre. Firefish. Um, no, no. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Umbreon's fun. I'd rather That'll be pretty fun. Time's too, coming though. up soon. So yeah, time coming up here in just a second. Main thing about uh, main thing about Umbreon is just keeping two pokes is so hard. <laughs> it's but, awful. Yeah. Uh, no snags. Eva's fight is one of the hardest fights in this game. Yeah, it's impossible. <laughs> Time. GG's. Okay. Sub estimate for everybody. <laughs> it was naughty, of course. <laughs> <laughs> you caught that would be a pretty good, pretty good quill to run. <laughs> Wait, that quill's awesome. Yeah, that's what he was going to do. Pretty good. Not too shabby. Yeah, my quill was also really good, the one I caught on my um, initial save. <laughs> Except Rizekin fought the optional on his way there. I didn't know they had vision. I'm pretty yeah. sure the ones in the casino would have vision too, so I was just like dodging the other guy and around the machines. Oh, we all can't show our starters at the end since someone reset. I already showed it, it's fine. <laughs> and there's my umbers. Oh my gosh, yeah, so I my guess the game still only has 101 special attack. 
<laughs> yeah, versus oh, so the 190 from Espeon. I think I finished with 117, so... Better than 101. But you, you can really, see how... Uh, that was a really good uh, croc. Meganium has less special defense than Espeon, so it would just take target from most things. It was nice. Yeah. Wait, nice. I didn't get to sh I didn't get to show it off because I had a really good uh, croc on, but uh, a lot of, about half the time Espeon will finish with a higher attack stat than Fralligator's special attack. <laughs> oh gosh, which is quite sad. <laughs> it's not great. Unoptimal, even. Umbreon Road is beginner friendly because it teaches you how to uh, do a lot of RNG rolling. It is beginner friendly and it lets you get on runs. You might not finish runs because of EY is so bad, but. So, yeah, with Umbreon, you, you just have you to hit them a nip and you have a run. Um, but versus all the other starters, you have Dude, to hit them a nip go. and then hope you get a good secondary. I just caught the strongest shadow in the entire game. Let's go. <laughs> good job. Let's God. go. And you only gamer? used a regular Pokeball. Uh, so, yeah, it's because I didn't dupe my Great Ball. I'm uh, coming I up didn't dupe the Master Ball on Evis, so I had to Pokeball the Quill. I'm coming up <laughs> on being able to show my starter. My cut, my credits are over. Look at that thing. A force of nature. This is my true secondary. <laughs> 36 special attack. Uh, kind of rough. Nah. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Oh yeah, if uh, you're, oh you didn't see it. Sometimes uh, the there's a fert in lab that it doesn't. I don't think it knows any physical moves. It'll use surf and flamethrower. It's really funny. Just does zero oh, damage. Really? It's so That's... bizarre. It's silly as hell. Well, all right. You know what I want to say. Yep. Uh, thanks for watching. Glad was it. Yeah. Glad we were able to show this race off. It was a lot of yeah. fun. Hope you all enjoy the salsa. Uh, join the. Follow XD Discord server if y'all want to see any more salsa. There's great meme emotes and activity, such as Thai smirk, uh, salsa, literally salsa, and also, of course, Mirror B uh, in 25 emote form. And make Wait, sure who, to watch the VOD if you would like that? to see the rest of it. And uh, yeah. yeah, there's going to be more PSR Marathon going on for the next day. And a little more as well. I believe next is my guy. Uh, on what diamond? Yep, so, my yeah, my guy on diamond. And like, congrats on all those ones. They were very, very fun to watch. <laughs> yeah, like, it's, 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 learned a lot too. Having to wake up because it's <laughs> way too early right now. Stop complaining. I've been up all night. Oh, oh I'm, I'm, it's true. I'm, I'm gonna be on tech for the next. Okay, like I'll, I'll be on tech for like ten hours today. Yeah, you've done so much work for this. It's crazy. Shout outs oh to gosh. Jordan. I don't know. Yeah, shout out to that Jordan and all of. But insane shout outs to Jordan for being a huge part of organizing this marathon along with everyone else uh, on the committee. Uh, they've done a great job, and yeah, but especially thanks to Jordan for just putting so much stuff together and uh, reaching out to people, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So yeah. Can, this wouldn't happen without Jordan. Thank you very much. And it's thank you to everyone NASCAR like you mentioned theme. as well. NASCAR theme is the best. Yeah, theme. thank you for also joining us on NASCAR's theme. It's beautiful. <laughs> no problem. Um, 